I went back and listened to like 45 episodes since we recorded. Man. I did because I can't deal with I got to do the intro. I got to deal with her and you. Though. I got to do the what intro a lot do? better. Uh, <laughs> I'm not putting nobody business on the world. We haven't um, started yet, so we are starting. You didn't even say yo. I know starting. that. I'm trying to let you know that I'm trying to get the intro better. Like the intro needs to be better. The when last episode you was like, yo, why don't you slow down? I'm like, you know, why do I just start talking like a professional intro? We yeah, need a professional intro. Okay. When I said that, that was tight. So I'm gonna do a I'm gonna do a real good intro today. All right. No, what intro? What's like your what? intro? People don't like that. Yo, sneak this podcast, George, Greg, and I'm still back in the building, and the producer. Okay, you just did it. We did appreciate you? everybody Good who job. watches and listens to this on Spotify, <laughs> iTunes, Podbean, Stitcher, yeah, people Google like Play, that. and everything. Appreciate everybody who views us visually on YouTube. Like, subscribe, share. Any platform that you do listen to us on, please review, like, or share. If you have anything negative to say, DM me first, and then I'll review it. Then you could go ahead and post it on Bruh, any platform you, know? you listen to. That's a perfect intro. No, it's not. People don't like that. What do you want me to do? Yo, what's up, everybody? Yo, sneak this podcast, yo. Look, I don't even know. I never did that before either. <laughs> Episode 165. We used to do a kind of a, a pretty a formal intro when we did yeah, jerseys. And people don't like that. They love jerseys. No. We st we started hating jerseys. What's jerseys got to do with How do they thing? start like intro. radio shows? I haven't listened to the radio in a long time. <clears throat> Nobody though. likes a long formal thing. That wasn't long. That was about 12 seconds. That's long when you try to get to the content. I remember when you first did the thing, like the, the might have been the first couple of shows we did, and Alan, who knows nothing, was like, "Bro, why is your intro like two minutes long?" It's that was so like boring. episode, like that was because yeah. it was pre-recorded, no and that was Simple's voice. I, said, I understand that. I didn't say it was you. Oh, I said you, but you put it in, bro. We was learning was the most boring thing in history. We were learning. Yeah, this right here is better. This is what people like. What's up this with you what, today? This what made people no, laugh. no, you know what. You oh, told we can you talk got, about that no, too. No, you talking about you got to deal with me and deal with her. Why I got to deal with you? Uh, Did you see uh, what tapes said? Yeah, tapes is on my side. What tapes say? Look, look where he commented on Twitter. Oh man, come on. Yep, I'm not going to Twitter. Uh, you got to tell That's me what he guy, said. Uh, That's my guy. <laughs> yeah, all right. Look, ever since we followed each other on Twitter, no? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see. I don't see nothing he said. Tape said it's cringe every Tuesday when LeBron posts that nonsense. Cringe and corny ain't the What's same the thing. thing. Okay, I what? Love, I love Talk of Tuesdays by LeBron James. Of course you love it. <laughs> Why? Of course she loves it. What does that got to do with anything? You know, lately your corny meter has been way off, dude. Used to be the the literally the, no, everyone no, 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 on no, Twitter no, no, no. except like no, one person no, agreed with no, me. No, 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 no. Who agreed with you? No, 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 no. Who agree with you? No one even said anything. I mean, they I'm, just liked everything we said. That was it. I was basic, I'm basing on likes. Your corny scale has been way off lately. It's been way off. Huh? I'm about to revoke your corny card. You used to be the the, you the don't king. You have the ability to oh, revoke no, I can, someone's no. corn card. I'll take you your corny one. card. You don't I'm like the Taco king Tuesday? of calling corn out. Right? No, lately you've been off with corny stuff. He huh? doesn't no, like Taco Tuesday. I'm not. No, he he look. He's the LeBron James, the LeBron Taco Tuesday, the newest one. You didn't one. believe he was corny until I told you he was corny. Okay, and then, then Simple was like, oh, yeah, he is. And then finally you got on the bandwagon like six months after. Whoa. When you when I commented today, I said LeBron is corny when LeBron is by himself being corny. Him being goofy with his wife and kids yeah, at the I, table isn't corny. It's like, yes, it's it dad. Is. Like what? Okay, If stop you're just it, hanging huh? out and you're not making a – they made it like a – he. No, I shouldn't say they. He made it like it was a production to be corny. That's the whole point. That, yes, he's but just he's being dad family. to be to do that. He's filming it. That's not just being dad. That's I'm trying to get views and likes. What did you know? What year this is? This ain't like. What are you talking about? Everybody does. What does it got to do with anything? Didn't you just everybody say everybody does because on I don't earlier. care about that kind of stuff. So maybe that's why it's coming from me. Okay, so maybe it's corny to you. Thank you. Okay, but don't act and like if it's not else, corny to me that it's insane. Every like you, you act like change the topic every time. You were like, oh, it's crazy. I didn't say anything about crazy. Then you said it's wacko, something else. I didn't say anything about wacko. All I right. said corn. Literally, ESPN putting LOL in stitches or crying face or whatever at that video is the corniest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Let me tell you Did something. Did that I've video learned. have you in stitches? No, I exactly. What does that got to do with the? That was corny. my whole point of the beginning. 
No, if you would have said this isn't funny, oh, it's not funny. Yeah, this I is said, him being. Of course, ESPN would laugh at that corn. Is what I said. Oh no, I've learned that there are people that find stuff much more funny that I never do. I learned that going on trips and stuff. I yeah. want people that I don't typically hang out with all the time. Different sense of humor. When I watch TV commercials, you know, TV commercials should be funny. I actually yes. sit around people and they're laughing at the TV commercial. I don't think I've ever yes, laughed. That's life. That's normal. I, no, I don't laugh at TV commercials unless it's really funny. There's like no. Yes, we talk about this like when that, the Super Bowl funny. stuff happens. Okay, we always talk about this. Okay, you know, like I said, ninety percent of the commercials know, on I Super don't Bowl know. are not for no, us. You're corny. Right? You're corny. You're corny. Oh, you off? People bro. disagree. You're with not you. the same no more. People though. disagree with you. Oh, you a little off. Though. Ask tapes. So they disagree. Nah, with you. I think you you might need to go see the doctor. Pe- what's the difference between cringe and corn? I'm just trying. To That's not the same. That's, oh. because, what's the difference? Yo, yo, yo. The difference between cringe and corn. Anna, what's the difference between something no, that's cringy no, and corny? You, no, 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 I'm asking answer. Anna. I want to ask. I don't Anna. think LeBron's thing is cringy. He's with his family. Cringy. Let me tell you, cringy. Sitting at a table with somebody you've known for a very long time. I've never heard her say a hip word in my life. Who? And yesterday, I'm not saying a name. Oh, I know. Who. And yesterday, she goes YOLO at the bar. Yeah, oh, that's cringy. Yeah, I know you're talking about. I thought you were talking about. That makes you go. Under. <laughs> I thought you were talking about Rocio. No, that <laughs> that would make me want to go under the t- under the bar, like oh my god. And then, but it, even what? No, oh, no, 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 right. no, no. What even made it even more cringy? She wasn't no, saying no, it because no, you no, because I, like black no, people. No, 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 no. Now, what made it even that's, more cringier? That's cringy. No, what when, even when white, corny white people are like trying to say hip stuff that like is in the urban community? That's cringe. She. What made it even more cringy was somebody there who I thought would know what YOLO stood for goes. What? And then that person that said it goes, YOLO means you only live once. And I was like, dear God, like somebody th- yes. throw a beer bottle on my head. You're embarrassed for that person, yes. Cringy. Yes. That's cringy. You're embarrassed for LeBron James? No, no I haven't been embarrassed for LeBron James's public persona for a long time. LeBron He's a cornball. James, no, no, no. LeBron James sitting in the back like- of a car. Listening to everybody, music is fire. He listened to right, just relax. Corny. Stop, stop making examples. LeBron James relax. posting his own Listen. highlight video. Corny. LeBron James yes. posting dinner, being goofy with his kids, yelling Taco Tuesday. It ain't the funniest thing in the world to me, but it's like it's just he's with his family. He's with his family. I didn't it make a big deal about it. You came at me. All I said was ESPN would retweet this corn. Came that at was me. The, you did. You everybody replied. added me. Wait, he did <laughs> I didn't even know about this. Everyone kept so, at me. So he, I think he did it because AD was there. But did you see? Yeah, but I don't care about any of that. Yeah, but what did you think? Did, Anthony Davis didn't really want to join in. Is that his um, wife in the video, by the way? Yeah, or okay, that's his know. wife. Okay, because I don't know enough. Like when I when tape no said AD, you said nothing. something every Tuesday, and then tape said the same thing every Tuesday. So I assume he posts the same. I don't follow Tuesday. LeBron, so I yeah. This is not so, the first Taco yeah. Tuesday. Okay, that's fine. So every Tuesday he does that. Every Tuesday. Okay, I didn't know that. Number one, it would not have changed my opinion. I don't know if he does it every Tuesday, but, but I've seen. And like, I don't know uh, enough about his family. If that's his wife or. Partner, I didn't know if it was like a sister or an aunt or That's whatever. LeBron's wife. Okay, Savannah. Right? So yeah. you just aren't sure they're like actually married, is why you say it. No, that's his wife. They've oh, been married for forever. Time. All right. Yeah. yeah. No, no, I know they've been together for a long time, but I don't didn't know if that was her. I knew he, whoever yeah. he was with with him got all them kids. They've been together a long time. That was it. That was okay. Her. So she was like, the first look on her face was like, I'm embarrassed for you. Stop putting me on video. Stop it. That's okay, just okay. wife girlfriend stuff. Yeah. If I got the camera with Rocio, was like, ah, she. Oh my god, she would do that. It okay. wouldn't be corny that I did that. So what's the face mean then? Oh come on, George. We, what's up? What's up, man? No, you know no, what? no, you know what? I'm Explain. gonna give you no, no, no. You know, this is a new segment alert. All right, what's corny <laughs> to you? All right, I'm about to give you a few examples, and you tell me if this is corny or not. Dad dressed like his kids and wife, taking a picture at Disneyland, posted on social media. Is that corny? Corn. Why is that corny? Why are you dressing everybody up in the same outfit? Some people <sighs> like that. At Disneyland, I mean, the scenario you just gave me is like a, 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 the totem pole of corn. Now, if you took professional pictures and you went out like in a field and no one see you, you not oh a celebrity. Oh my God, I'm you not a celebrity. Flask at you, whatever it's called. What are you talking about? Why I gotta be in an abandoned field to take a why, picture with my family you, and be dressed the why same? Why are you focusing on the abandoned no, field? He means the, the point that that. Is a photo. Who cares the fact that it's not Disneyland? What Pick something other than the most busiest place on earth. Why do we gotta be in seclusion to be happy and dressed like why do you got to be dressed the same? Because it's for my kids and my family. What about like matching pajamas on Christmas or something? Yeah, but what are you doing it for? You just doing it like funny haha? No, that's not it's corny. Like a you do whatever thing. you want. He literally
literally said, oh, we all dress up the same. We go to Disneyland. Okay. Corn. Okay. So me taking a picture with Cortez and Oscar all wearing Cortez. Is that corny? No. Why not? <laughs> well, we're all wearing the exact same shoes. Well, we ain't corny. Okay. Are you talking about the one that you took in California? Yeah. Because y'all were not wearing the same shoes. Okay. Same we had model. Colors. Fine. It's completely different than dressing everyone up the same way and taking a picture. Guy and girl, wife, husband, boyfriend, girlfriend, dressed the same going to the bar to hang out or the club? Corny. Mm. With your little kids. We, and, to me, it's weird. It's and, not corny. And, it's and, weird. And wife has Minnie Mouse. I have Mickey Mouse shirt no, and the kids you, have a the shirt. Re, what makes it corn is you specifically taking a picture and making a big deal about it in public. If someone's going to the bar dressed as alike... To me, it's not corny because you're just going to the bar. I don't making care. Making a big deal, showing my family at Disneyland? Why is it making a big deal? Who doesn't take a picture at Disneyland and post it? Who specifically dresses up the same to go do that? You've never seen people at Disney. Okay, they didn't go dress the same specifically to Disneyland to take a picture. They're going dressed the same at Disneyland because they're going to Disneyland, the happiest place on earth. I'm dad, That's I'm weird. wearing the Mickey shirt, mom is wearing mini shirt, and the kids can wear mini Mickey too, if a boy and girl, whatever the okay, case may be. that's fine. Is it all the same color and matchy-matchy and everything, or is it just like Why Disney shirts? Why is speculation? Why does it got to be Some people have What are you talking about? Some people have them with if their me, names. If me and you got a New Balance shirt on and it's two different New Balance shirts, it's not the same. What do you mean? Is it corny when people wear the same shirt to like a family reunion? If you specific, no, 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 like when a shirt is designed for everybody to wear, yeah. no, you just honoring your family. That's completely different. But they do that at Disneyland. What do you mean? They have shirts like that. So That's if fine, I'm but you go. talking about specifically going and setting people up and taking a picture at Disneyland. That's hey, porn. Well, can, hey, hey, sir, hey, sir, can you take a picture of me and my family? Yeah, people take okay, pictures and, there. And, I, didn't, and I didn't bring a light. I didn't bring lights in, in, a, in a shade. <laughs> Yo, man, hey, can you take a picture of me and my kids and wife? Thank you. And you're all media. wearing the exact same outfits. Okay, maybe my shirt's white yeah, that's cool. with Mickey and the wife's shirt's red with Minnie. That's and not the, the same shirt. to me. That's you talking but about you know talking what? Doesn't matter. Things. What if we're all wearing red shirts and I got Mickey, Minnie, Minnie, Mickey? What, what, what if? What if? What if we all got red shirts? If you, what if? If you planned it out that way, to me, that's corn. Period. If we all planned as a family, wear yes. our Mickey red shirts and to, to go to Disneyland, the happiest to to place Disney on earth. No, specifically to go to Disneyland to take a picture that you went to Disneyland, corn. To me. Oh, you think corn. we're going to Disneyland specifically to take a picture and you think we're going to Disneyland specifically to dress alike? What do you think this is, man? It's like a thousand dollars to walk inside Disneyland. We did. Why'd you dress alike then? Because we're a family. We're having fun as a family. What does that? Why? <laughs> what does that? Okay, another example. I no, don't no, no, understand no. why. No, no. Like, why? Be why? You you're just, the you're just being family. You're just being dad. You're just oh being mom. God. Like, hey, let's all get matching outfits and go to Disneyland, and be a family, have fun. We all got Mickey ears and me. What's wrong with that? There's nothing wrong with it. Okay. Who said there's anything wrong okay. with it? Again, why I'm is it corny? You change it. Why is it corny? It's corny to me. If you specifically dressing up to, no, no. Cool. to go no, somewhere no. in it. public to be seen no. and take a picture, that's, no, corn. No, no. That's Period. perfectly fine. Once you say to me, perfectly fine. I've you, which I've told to you me. for years, you argue because you can't believe it's not that way to no, anybody else. No, no, no. That's what I always say about you. When you argue, no, you argue. The LeBron thing no, had no. to do with you change the topic every time. First stop, it was crazy, you, then it was something else. You I didn't argue, say none of that. You argue, I didn't say it was crazy. You argue, I didn't say it was I've told anger you this. or whatever I've the other thing you, you said. forever. Now, I always say everything that we say is opinionated facts, but you treat your opinion as facts when you argue you. And I'm Everybody like Everybody does. Okay, but you've made your point, but you but I say it's not corny to me. <laughs> oh my god, bro, what's up with you? No, no, no. You didn't say though. it's not corny to me. You said you literally said something like what's wrong with you? Example girl? 2. If somebody locally said, "Hey, we want to come to the studio to take pictures and interview you guys your sneaker podcast and I brought a ton of shoes and had them in here to take pictures and do it." Is that corny? No, because that's what the show is about. Okay, cool. Now, somebody goes to Kanye house and said, we want to talk about Yeezys and the whole process of designing shoes. And he says, okay, cool. Oh, no, 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 no,
That's not dope pictures. He looked like he was in the middle of a uh, Illuminati. All that's right, not that's, that's, that's <laughs> yeah, the point. The Freemason. That's the point. <laughs> Wait, what do you was want from that me? corny for him to take bring his all the samples out to take a picture? I don't of, think during don't an think, interview for, for about no. The I don't think no. Corny is the right word, but I think weird is the right word because you could have went in the factory and just saw him on the show. But it was for Forbes What's magazine. The difference? <laughs> do you think the pictures were cooler because it was out in the street? Oh yeah, would have been on the shelves if they would have put the um, bunch of bunch of that was a lot of sneakers. They're he got a million counters in that building. I know you've seen the counters with all the stuff on okay, it. Like, what all, are you talking the about? They're trying to attract people but, to look at it, though. Because I know it's not. Uh, I know it's not the same building. I know How do you it's know not. it's not the same building? Because that one was an empty retail store. I know what that building was. The, the first building that had all the samples on the long table, that was an empty retail store. That wasn't the warehouse place. I How? know that. Because I know what store it was. I know what store it's going to be. That's a fact. Uh, now. You must know Wex personally. Oh, no, no. So. I Trust me, somebody had to let them use that building to do that. Facts. It's not even a question. Okay. Okay. Do is we know what corny? tables are in the warehouse? Now look, what if they got no, the no, same no. tables in the warehouse? Not could have been done better. Is it corny or not? No, I said no already. That's not the right awesome. word. That's weird what? is the right word. It's still weird. It doesn't mean just because it's not corny, it means <laughs> no, not weird. weird. Yes, it is. Now. now me? Why do you no, need to no. take all that stuff outside for pictures? Because he's kind. He's over the top. Like, come on, yeah, man, because stop it. it's weird. He's a okay. weird. Do you think it was his idea, or do you think it was Forbes' idea? No, it absolutely was his idea. He's the number one narcissist in the entire galaxy. Um, yeah, so but absolutely his idea. That's but why you, don't you think hate that it. He's an like, insane person. No, there's no. a difference between that hate. kind of picture and just like a picture on the shelf. If you're trying to get people to read, I mean, the that, I don't hate any. Okay, first of all, hate's not the right word. Hate is like. Uh, Reserved for somebody who like person like so someone tried to rip me off, I hate personally like <laughs> personally affected me or my wife or family. I hate you. I don't hate Kanye. He's just a weird person. He's not for me. Okay. I don't hate him. Last example. Anna's at home sitting on the couch watching TV. Says I want to take out all my Jordan fives and line them up on the floor and take a picture of, of them in a circle. Is she spelling her name out? Or? Does it matter? She just laid them all in rows. She got about 15 pairs of Jordan 5s, laid them out in What's rows. What's the point of the picture? Are I'm, you done with your example yet or no? Corny or not. Corn. Okay. I'm fine with that. That's corny because there's it, it, no People reason for it. People literally make out the Jordan logo with their corn. shoes. Corn. Thank you. I know that. There's no point other than to put it on social media and be like, hey, look at me. Corn ball. Duh. But. That's the same thing LeBron is doing. Why are you yelling about that? Okay, man. LeBron James putting out his sneakers for fun for social media? Uh, right. Mad corny. Let's not go no, overboard that's here. corny. LeBron James. So what's the no, difference no, no, no. no LeBron, James, LeBron James taking a picture of sneakers in the car while driving in the back of some. That's corny. Unless it's the something we have seen before. The only reason you're saying that is because he gets them free from whatever he wants. That's the only reason you say no, that. No. If he's taking a picture of like, uh, you want a pair of Kyrie's today. And he's like, oh, supporting the homie or something. Corny. If he's taking a picture of a LeBron we've never seen before that might come yeah, out, yeah. oh, that's fire. Like, that's, that's cool. Not fire. It's not cool, fire, yeah. but it's cool. We yeah. get to see something. It's fine. <laughs> I don't know why you argue Yo, with corny me. Your probation, uh, it's on probation. Uh. You don't that's have the, end the, of the ability new segment, to do uh. that. I'm that's the creator a, uh, of it. This is a lot of feelings over a Okay, picture. you need to chill out with yeah, the feelings before we get feelings, into you. Yeah. <laughs> you see what the, you see, you know the thing is, you know what the, the, the best thing about this show is? The best thing about this show and me no, and George. No, no, wait, hold on. Before you say that, let me just go one step back. Would it have not been a better idea, in your opinion, I don't care what the <laughs> outside world is telling you, for Kanye and them to just have left them in the warehouse and take pictures in the warehouse? Would it have been easier? Yes. Of course, it's always an easier no, way to I do that. Better idea. Oh, you can't. I didn't think that was a bad idea. To well, put them on the ground outside and stand in the middle of a circle. I thought that was dumb. Okay. Like so, all right, so we're on the same page. But I think it's dumb because we <laughs> don't because we know the type of person Kanye is. It he, was, he had a concert where he was on a floating platform. Yeah, everything like, he does I mean, is like yeah, but that's uh, a concert. Like down. you're supposed to perform for people at that. Yeah, point. but Kanye magazine, stuff. So Kanye it has stuff. To be visual. Oh, Kanye's. They were in a like it was probably a parking lot in like Fontana. So what? <laughs> I mean, that's where Adidas is factory. Kanye, <laughs> Kanye. Fontana no. put the choice in a parking we're lot. We're getting Kanye the person. Like Kanye, everything he does is over the top. You're right. He's a performer at a concert. That's dope. But him being above us on a floating platform to him means something a lot more yeah, than just does. that's Maybe. cool. Yeah, it probably does. Other album, him being on the top of a pyramid and looking at something different. You're probably right. But at that point, he, nobody looked at him like he was a super weirdo yet. It, it didn't happen yet. I've always said Kanye really thinks he's up there with 
Jesus well, Christ and people song, like Jesus that. walks where he was on the cross. So he sure. he made he calls himself Jesus. He put his mom's face I mean, on a shirt like she's Mary Magdalene. Sure. Like at some point, <coughs> you definitely yeah, feel he's been a weird person. Great, yeah, facts. But that's why the pictures of him in a circle, like kneeling in a circle, surrounded. Is weird to us because we're like, all right, settle down. But yes, he was doing an interview about the shoes. Is what it is. So you obviously feel the same way it I do. Was corny? Dumb it was corny. It was dumb, but it wasn't corny to me. Whatever. I like I said, corn might not be the right word. Last, listen, we're in the heat of the I discussion. I would even go with cringe. Week, all right? I would even go with cringe there. Like oh, tapes God. agrees with me. All right, that's, what, that's all. When did tapes become the standard? <laughs> tapes was a Tucson. That's my guy. That's my guy. Oh, period. That's, that's it. That's my guy. I was talking to him yesterday. Uh, tapes might be rich too. Like, he spends the most money I've ever seen on everything. Um, He's trying to buy my upside down logo hat to resell. I was like, fam, <laughs> wait till the site opens up. Chill out. I mean, I don't know enough about his background to say anything, but I'm just going to tell you, right. foam God cops everything. So we might have oh, a competition. Yeah. <laughs> they definitely got have a battle. Uh, sure, what are we talking about? Everybody weekend's good? Unplanned? Yeah. Um, oh, God. <laughs> no, I, good news. It wasn't the weekend. It was on Monday. My beautiful cousin, Jenny Lee. And her husband oh. welcomed baby Jack into the world. So congratulations. Woo, he's adorable. Congratulations. congratulations. U.S. Women's National Team and her cousin. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, that's good news. That's, that's good. good news. I have good news. That's good. You, think you should have good news. You still like in Arizona? Kind of? Yeah. Well, you said it's the greatest... Nice people, people of all are time. really nice. I can't say that Arizona people are nicer than California people. They're like the they same. They just to me. have conversations with you, and you're like, you're still talking to me, and it's so genuine. Like they make eye contact all right. and stuff. Do, when do, do I make eye contact on this podcast, or is it because I'm from LA, so I'm a dick? <laughs> no, it's just the cashiers are just like talking to you, you know. and they're like. <laughs> So I'm you like that? People, all right, I I'm, hate that. No, it's not that. I I get. I'm like, whoa, you're yeah. still talking to me. Depending on what day it is, I'm like, yo, what? Man, just go put my card chip in and just, oh, I gotta go. Is your weekend good? Oh my goodness, wow. <laughs> I hate when I go. I hate when I go to the grocery store and you like buy some grapes and like I I know they're trained to do this where they're like, man, I've been thinking about grapes all day. Oh God. I'm like, all right, you bring this up and you weigh this. No, right, See, no, that doesn't no, happen corn. everywhere. That happens here. No, that's corn. But that's train corn. Conversation conversation corn is not for me. Period. You know, low key, that's not right because one of your friends is pretty c corny. All right. Yes, but you do you think I? She's seen me. Do you think I like entertain the corn? Okay, you act like I've never seen you. No, no, but recently, multiple times. I can't hear stuff. What? You can't hear? This one's. Oh, it's Bruh, just that one. Actually, matter stuff. of fact, let's just let Anna tell you the story from what happened. Sa was it Saturday? Was Saturday night? You don't want to tell Friday. that story. No, no, it has. No, it's I story. can't hear you. You're yeah. Have, have her tell you the story. What's the story? I don't want to. Don't tell use her. names. No, it has nothing to do with you. You know how it has to do with. I know who it, ha who it has to do with. I don't just tell the story. Just tell about. the just tell the basics of the story. Look, somebody give me the gist. George, you tell it. I don't want to oh tell God. it. All right. Anyways, the person you're speaking about, we'll say no names. We were at a bar. Saw somebody who he think who uh, he kissed. Apparently, whatever. Not a man. It's a woman. <laughs> He she, said he spent the entire night. So see, you want to tell the story out. now? Well, there you go. Take over. No. <laughs> All right. Jump in there, you don't want to tell the story. Go on. But you were talking about the person who well, you think I encourage the corn, and I don't. So this is my example. He was talking. The, so the girl was at the bar, but we didn't know she was there. She left, walked out. This was Friday, not Saturday. Uh -huh. She left. I was like, "Look, there's so and so." He didn't see her. For the next hour maybe hour and a half he w turned into like Rico Suave. a zombie no. robot depression mode like if you, a robot had depressed me and you pressed the button and he just went like this like a robot shut and that sound mm. <laughs> maybe there was that sound and we just it couldn't was hear it. the weirdest thing we spent oh, what are you upset about oh because i'm so worried about it and i think maybe like 
I could have done something that would have got me in trouble if she would have told the police. And then <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. I know this story. This is something from a long time ago. He's yes. still talking about that? He's yeah. told me this before. If you know the story, then yeah. Why is he still worried about that? Bruh. You know you <laughs> You and you think I encourage it. Though. We spent about an hour <laughs> trying to cheer him up. Oh, then you guys are weirdos too. Then though. that's no, your fault. You, you encourage that. If, you, if never, you're in a bar trying to cheer somebody up, that's that's a diff, that's that's I, that's we, encouraging. We had it. all been drinking for like three, four hours already. Like we we weren't in normal state of mind <laughs> at that point. We already had tacos by then. <laughs> oh my we, god! Trying to bring somebody out of a depression in a bar is insane. They shouldn't be out. Uh, it was very yo, strange. I've never I, seen it ever. What you guys are talking about? He told me that maybe the first time I met him. Like, oh, no, 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 it's a different story then. No, I know what it is. No, because it didn't happen that long ago. This just happened like three, four months ago, maybe five months ago. Have I seen him since? You know what? Yeah, he talked probably. about it, y'all. He talked about it at the VIG. I th feel like he talked about it. Okay, well, then that's possible. I know it. I know what it is. Uh, that's possible. Bruh, he needs a psychologist. Uh. That's a 100% fact. <laughs> duh, uh. duh. Bro, he's this close to going to turn himself in for no reason. Uh. <laughs> he might be the only person I know that goes to... I, I didn't do anything, but, like, I feel like I should be in jail. <laughs> like, what is up? Huh? <laughs> I've never heard of Yo, he needs to chill out. Huh? He you needs to relax. You should have said anything. Huh? Why did you even say anything? Oh, my god. Why did I say anything? I oh, don't know, because she was already outside. Like, she wasn't even... Oh, you mean why did I say anything to him right then? Yeah, I didn't I even what see she her. Was that thinking. was a normal reaction. Oh, there goes... I wasn't like I was pointing to him, like, oh, I, I just went like this. Oh, there goes listening. to <laughs> me. You making it sound like I, like... Grabbed him was like, oh, <laughs> no, I just no, was like, oh, literally, he just said that. And then, like, he it, turned around and like, was like, where? And then her back face around just and was like, like, where? He did, only did it twice. <laughs> like, bro, she's already outside. Huh? She screamed and clutched her neck. I've never seen anything like it. Oh, my gosh. You've seen an awful lot the last few days. Um, <coughs> what are we talking about? Nothing else this weekend? Yes, the Nothing show else good? Even started yet. I ain't even do anything. I, I mean, it has started. Going to see Lion King this weekend. Oh, no, no. Oh. You started the show, but I'm saying, like, uh, they're not even the topics yet. It's 30 Going minutes. to Lion King. Am I going to see Lion King? I didn't care to go I'd see Lion to. King. I mean, shout out to my wife. My wife, obviously, the love you of my life. You already know the answer for me, so. She is, for her clients, all of her clients throughout the year, she rents out an entire movie theater and let them get to watch it for free. So, uh -huh. the movie this year is I Lion King. I have seen the original one all the way through. No. Why would I go see that one? Huh? What is wrong with you? Mm -hmm. The <laughs> so angry. Let's not go through the list of movies um, you haven't seen. Okay, movie that you that you, you haven't seen. Top Gun. <laughs> I've never seen Top Gun. Oh God! There's a lot of movies I haven't. You know, seen. You last week was really it last week when me. Greg said that's because you're a girl. That's the answer I, right there. It's because you're a girl. No, it's not. But you're old enough to yes, see Top is. Gun. Yes, it is. She's yes. my age. I'm same age. Yes, but just off age, you should have seen Top Gun. Whether you like wanted to see it. On, even on accident, you should have seen Top Gun by now. Yeah. Of course. I've seen movies that are obviously, <clears throat> that came out before you I was born. If a male probably would have been more inclined to agree with your assessment. Your have you seen uh, I'll tell you the movies. Wizard of Oz? Yes. Okay. I'll tell you movies that like, people are like, how could, how could you have not seen that? I've never seen The Gladiator. I've never seen that. I've well, never it's seen not The um, Gladiator. <laughs> Number oh, one, Gladiator. Gladiator. I've never seen it. What's that? I have, it, I have it, but I just haven't. Like watched. I said, let's not talk about the list of things you haven't seen. The Rock. Never seen that. Oh my oh god. god! I know. I heard. I heard that one's good. <laughs> good as a stretch. It's entertaining. I love it, but yes, it's like, entertaining. Yeah. It's like Con Air. I love okay, Con Air. Well, like, no, like, Con Air is actually I well Con written. It's like, a phenomenal. You can movie. make an argument really is, that is so. well written. I just don't know I, why I they like gave Nicolas Air. Cage long hair. I, why did he have to have hair like that? You, there's a lot of questions you can ask about that movie. The hey. concept of Face Off is a good concept. The movie's like pretty much kind of terrible. It, it's not held up at See, all. Yeah, I can't but remember. But the concept if I've was good. Face, Face Off. Face Off came so out around weird. that time too, and I can't remember. <coughs> I don't know. Have you seen Die Hards? Any of them? End up eating these whole yes. things. Yes. Me too. Oh, I'm trying to think of some. They're more. Good. I'm gonna think of some more. Yes, they are. But yeah, my wife is doing a client of appreciation. Rented trash. out the entire theater for Lion King, so it was about a hundred some plus people that she, you know. Takes care of them, buys them popcorn, cups, and everything. So shout out Rocio. Shout out to Rocio. Great job. Um, anybody going to Area Fifty One or anything? No, right. no? y'all not rocking on Area Fifty One. I like that that tweet that I sent said last time somebody tried to break in, they killed them. <laughs> what would you What would you That's rock? Actual though? confirmation. What would you rock to Area Fifty One? <laughs> 
You're a teacher. Area okay. 51 pack. No, this is LeBron. a serious question. <laughs> like Bro, did we buy those? We bought those. Area 72. I don't know if it was that. Oh, we yeah, bought yeah. LeBron's and you bought that was pizza. Kobe pizza. I don't think I got those. Then did I get We them? lost on those. We both somehow. had them in the car. One of us had them in the car. You I feel won like it was then. You. I lost. So that we, was literally when, when Sneaker Valet started and we lost at Scottsdale. I was like. I got. And then and Alan, then, oh, and no, then Alan rewrote the code to make it pass. You held. They held LeBron's at Arizona Mills for you. We zoomed across town. We got one. Yeah, or, but I won or something. Yeah. I won the lottery or whatever it was. Around. But we told them, like, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> they held <laughs> so them for we us. Are we gave them a weird story, <laughs> and they held them for us. And then we went to the Desert Sky and got a pair of LeBrons or something. Oh, KDs. We got KDs from Nike Scottsdale, the green alien colors. We thought those were going to be tight. Simple ball, every single one in the entire collection. He bought the Air <laughs> the Force LeBron ones. flipped, and the Kobe slipped at first. Yeah, they did. I probably made like fifty bucks or something off the Lebrons, or maybe a hundred. Oh, bucks. the best one of the pack was the the joints you like. The um, I got two Lebrons. The Barkley so I got one at Nike and one at. I didn't get those. Yeah, none of us. That was like Simple the hardest did. one to get. That oh, was because so. that joint was fire. That joint had like glow in a dollar. It's oh, trash. It was, it was like it was easy. That it joint was fire. Been like the boot it pack, was though. fire. Not is fire. That joint is like an actual boot pack. Are, since you're the educator, you're a teacher. Right? Is yes. it okay to say that you're a teacher? You believe in teacher. aliens? Why does it, what does that got to do with believing in aliens? It's Area Fifty One. I mean, I, no, but what does being a teacher got to do? She's <laughs> an educator. People think differently when they're educators. It's they a do. possibility, though. Yeah, they do. We don't know what's out Not there, like way out there. Yeah, nobody really knows, so I can't Good answer. I can't tell kids like. Okay, I ain't they definitely like, don't exist or something like that. The answer is humans are not smart enough to know. Like us regular humans. Also, I teach very <laughs> small children. I teach kindergartners and first graders, and so I don't want to like break their spirit. Like, there might be some like technology that the U.S. government has, or some government has that has found stuff or whatever, but we're not gonna know about it. I'm glad they hide we stuff like that. We don't even like know that. Kennedy yet. No, we do. Okay. Want a John Wilkes Booth? Okay. Oh wait, no, he killed Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> <laughs> That's only like 130 years. That's about or, a hundred or 145 actually. years ago. Though. Abraham died no, in like 1836. So he's just spitting out numbers. Civil War era. No, he did die in 1836. No, no. Hey, Civil War era. I have to check now. I'm about to check with Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> died. I teach. You know what's out? 1863, I, teach I believe. Civil War era. Yeah. So there you need to chill Okay, I got you my three and six numbers, mixed up. I was like, no. So, so you should know when the Civil War is. Like, Simple was talking about that World War II the other night. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like 1865. Years. You're right. The guys, look, just got him so much stuff. So, uh, like I said, it's about 100 years difference between Abe Lincoln and Kennedy. Yeah, Kennedy died, what, 70 plus years no. ago now? 50 something? Oh, well, I don't know. 61, 63. It's been a while like now. Yes. But, anyways, that's not the man. <laughs> who yeah, the one of John Wilkes Booth. But... And even if people are convinced they know who did it, like it was Lee Harvey Oswald or whatever, right. we don't that's have confirmation. That's my point. No one has confirmation, regardless of what they believe. So, we definitely have zero confirmation if aliens exist. So Dude, her answer you is perfect. You believe in aliens? I believe anything's possible. No, you don't. <laughs> yeah, I do. Okay. I've told you before on religion. I'm not a religious person. I don't personally believe in it, but I also don't believe that humans are smart enough to know whether a god exists. Okay. I've always said that. I don't know why you think I didn't say that. Do you think aliens are Area Fifty One? I mean, it's possible. The military says that that's not what it's for, but they have every incentive to lie. So. Why is it so heavily guarded? Like, I get why it's guarded, but like, <sighs> I think it's, it's guarded. I one mean, of the most it, heavily okay. guarded things in the country. So let me say this: world. If aliens are not there, alien technology or bodies or one of the, if they had aliens walking around, workers as the workers, now, would that would be crazy. Right? <laughs> but yo, if yo, aliens yo. are not. <laughs> If aliens yeah, are not yeah, there, yeah. the answer has Dang. to be just because they don't want Americans to show up and get bombed to hell since it's like literally the active range of missiles, explosions. I don't think, like, I'm not. You don't want that story on your hand where it's like a family today disappeared in Area 51 and got hit by a cluster bomb. Either you don't want way, that. either way, if there's aliens there, I might go and. Mm -hmm. God, dude, yo, I'm about to have a, a chit chat with these guys, though. Like, I'm, I got enough. We might have to put those arms back in. Well, you, know? we, you might want to cut this part out. I'm just gonna let you know ahead of time. We don't pay our bills, so we probably can't. I gotta send you money anyways. Uh, you should have kept some of that money you sent me today. Um, I thought, uh, yeah, sir, I sent them cat's email. I didn't even read it. I was so mad. Huh? I thought a certain. I'm getting was sick. I don't give a shit. I'm getting sick of gold. Oh, they you better got get their shit together. Yeah, because I emailed them like, fam, what's up? Huh? 
Like, yo, oh, where them you bags didn't tell at? Me you got an email. Yeah, because I emailed them once, you, once I saw that stupid goat you sent. That goat. <laughs> I was like, man, I emailed them. I was like, yo. I said, I emailed them and said, I don't even. Should I ask what's up? Any updates? <laughs> sent this long thing about being summer vacation and the melanin and skin. I didn't read it, though. I was like, you know, maybe George will read it at the podcast. I, I'm not reading it because I might get angry. Anyways. Uh, I actually hope there is aliens, though. I don't want to go get the ones that are captured because, I mean, what we, we free them and they'll be angry. Like, they're not going to be like, thank God, like, I'm free. But aliens coming down, I think it'd be, it'd be lit. Do we need aliens to come down, though? If aliens came out of space, it would end, it would end racism, it end a lot of stuff. The, no. the, what? You mean, like, the, oh. the world would, like, rally against Oh, the, I have no choice. Yeah, but then it would be right back you to the really same place. You really want, what if the really, aliens are super powerful and they kill us all or something? Bruh. What happened after 9-11? I mean, uh, yeah, the 9 11. Everybody was together for about one year, two years. Well, that's and that's that. a while. About three years. And you're imagining like these powerful aliens. What if they're just like an amoeba? I'll tell you what. Oh, like, yeah. Uh, I'm not necessarily saying they're powerful, but like something that we have to fight against. Either way, like, I don't care what weapons we have. We have nothing that would fight against aliens if they could fly here and break time barriers and whatever the case to get here. We'd, yeah. we'd have nothing. Yeah, we need Captain Marvel. Like, no, no, we just need to just give up. We just. Give up. Let, let them do whatever they want to us. Nothing. Uh, fam. They come to your house knocking on the door, ask for your your Nike as your SB. <laughs> yes. I'll be like this here, five thousand, please. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, trying to upsell alien, <laughs> resell aliens right. would be crazy. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, that's funny. Absolutely I wonder what they right. look like though. <clears throat> look, I don't even like, want to know. Uh, all right. I, I believe in aliens. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, right, weird on. things be happening. Uh, I feel like we're going to accidentally see each other. Like, we will never, we can never try to see each other. You haven't even seen Captain Marvel yet, and you talking about aliens. Uh. It don't matter. Man, you think you're so tight because you saw Captain Marvel already. <laughs> now I got something over your head. Pause. Uh. I'm going to watch it. I haven't watched it. I don't think it's necessary to watch. We'll see. Did you see Captain Marvel? Yes, I did. I just don't think it's necessary to watch. I watched the 15 minutes, everything you need to know about it. Oh, no, I'm no. Good. It's way more, gives way more background on Marvel in general than anybody, than people who haven't seen it realize. Way more. And the deleted scenes, not deleted scenes, but the post credit scenes yeah, seen lead directly into. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. Okay, corny, though, when they play I'm Just a Girl, no doubt when she's fighting. That was corny. I didn't even see. I don't even realize stuff like that. But yes, you're either. absolutely That's right. That's corny. Yeah. yeah, you're absolutely right. Like stuff like that, I don't really realize. But I didn't. But, like, yeah, there are I didn't times know. I have noticed stuff like that in movies, and I'm like, all right, settle down. Uh, pickups. Anybody got any pickups? No. <clears throat> I know George does. Yeah. Um, everything. Everything. Uh, sketch Air Max One Red. I might have said that last week. Did I say that last week? Yes. Oh, did you just get it in hand though? No, they. So, so they. Uh, I hadn't heard from them. Assumed it was going to be canceled or something. And I emailed them, and then I went on their Twitter and noticed that somebody else had sent them an email. Not about the same shoe, but they were like, basically, what's going on, man? I ordered something like a week ago. Haven't heard anything. They were like, oh, send us a DM. So I sent them a DM. They finally responded to the email. We haven't got our Nike order yet. They haven't even got them yet. Like y'all can send an email out. This Ooh, says, story we haven't is? gotten our shipment yet. Feature. Feature does that a lot when it comes to like order and stuff. Every I've done that before. Like when and they were like. I thought I didn't know it was like as big as it is. They're like, oh, you got to call our online warehouse. I'm like, what? Call the warehouse. They're like, oh yeah, it hasn't come yet. Whatever. A lot of the stores are like that. That's what That's uh, Sockjig was telling me. Well, it's good in terms of if you get it from the monitor because then they don't know any better to cancel it. <laughs> if yeah. you get it from the monitor early, so I got those from the monitor. I don't know if I said that, but anyways, they haven't even shipped yet because they don't have their Nike order supposedly. I need to see them in hand. Um, you get your size. Simple said they're tight. Oh, he's simple got him? I got my... That's what he just texted. He oh, said the, I he said, look. The, oh. he said it's good materials. Um, Yeah, I got my size. What was um, retail Just on? because 150. Oh, dang. I saw him for 180 and I thought like, oh, that's a deal. I thought they what were What you like, call us are still in a full size run on Foot Locker website and they won't let me use my Foot Locker points. What, swipers? Yes. Oh, they're still on there? Full size run and they won't let me use my... Like, I can understand if they won't let you use a code. That's just a code. But why can't... If I can use my thing in store, my Foot Locker... You Points sure they won't let you use it in yeah, store? Oh, oh. No, no, no. You can in store. Oh. I don't want to let me use it online. It's just, the code is different when you put it in. Why is your system not sophisticated enough to do the difference? Anyways, those and then blazers. I don't know if I said that last week. Wait, the Soul, green ones, the white ones? Oh, yeah, blazers. Yeah. And Soul blazers. Sold. Oh, sold. I sold yeah. them already. 
because Andy Green didn't want him. And then Lundmarks. It's um, funny when stuff drops like <clears throat> you be when the, you be dying for, it, but then like when you actually get your hand on it, you be like, "No, I'm good." B. Lundmarks are <laughs> actually fire. Lundmarks, of course they are. Personally, personal opinion, Lundmarks are fire. Extreme fire. I think it's like. Uh, you would actually like them. I think it's more like a feminine shoe, a little bit, kind of. What color is Hannah really likes them, but it, I had a nine, so it was too big, and she didn't want to bother with it, so I just sold it. But um, it's like the, what did I call it? Like the poor man's. Um, Butters? What was the first Sesame? one? No, the first Yeezy. That it? No, oh, the first oh, Yeezy. Turtle Dove. Turtle Dove. Oh. Yeah, it's like the poor man's Turtle Dove. Not really, but kind of. No, it looked like it. It looks like. Off white, yellow. Oh. <clears throat> Well, that's all nah, you got. It's not yellow. It's off white. Them joints are like fire. Though. Tan or not tan? <coughs> what's the what's another color for off white? Beige or something Hope? like that? Yeah, Eggshell. There you, yeah. There you go. I don't know why they won't make any more with the stripe. Like, like the stripe is just over now. Like it's done. I thought the missing the stripe was just like a few models here and there. There's nothing in the upcoming future with the stripe. Um. Mm -hmm. Oh, you looked up Yeezy putting all his shoes outside. <laughs> You <laughs> looked at the list and was like, oh, yeah. None of the ones. Yeah, the blue ones that are going to come in. Them blue ones are super fire. Oh, all right. I got, I got nothing for you. You got anything else? No, nah, that's it. At least I can't think of anything. What comes out this week? Um, Peace Jam KD. Did that release today? Or that? No, I think no, it's no, Saturday. No. Them joints are fire. Oh, uh, they're right. They're cool. I'd never wear them, but them is cool. Um. Oh, I saw Air Max 270 Reacts in person. I didn't try them on. Oh. In person. Fire. The first ones are not see-through like the React 87, but these last couple that have come out are see-through on the toe box. And this I one like right those here. ones. Those ones yeah. are tight. This one right here, I don't, that like, was the, a I don't like the see-through. The best one, in my opinion, is the one the U.S. Women's National Team wore on their like victory tour or whatever. That's the one that comes out. I haven't seen that one. I guess it comes out technically next week. Some stores have already released early pairs, but it's a women's shoe, which upset me and then it's also see-through so women's shoes have been so much more fire than everybody else stuff there's not a picture on here um hold on a second so pgm kd that jordan one react high came out today i don't know if you saw pictures of that oh, yeah. i sent it to thread trash can i, I don't to me i don't think it sucks oh no no it sucks if it's just it like it just doesn't matter it's insignificant like it's like what is this like it's just an abomination like it's yeah so abomination means suck. i guess it does suck i'm tripping um the next what's a uh, utah man's name adidas utah man oh uh spider mitchell yeah the next spider one Symbiotes. comes out with the symbiote the black and pink um let's see what else oh joint 13's come out Thir 13 Lakers come out. Fire. <clears throat> Fire. I'm not a fan of 13, so I'm going to reserve judgment. You know, you, but you used know to love answer. 13s. No, I like I like the idea of flints, but you can't wear 13, so it doesn't matter. Yes, you can wear a 13. Yeah, if you're a child. <laughs> you they look a like a pin cushion. Size 7 or under, <laughs> exactly. That's what it reminds me of. Uh, Undercover right Daybreak there. Yellows <laughs> come out. For oh, some reason, are, people seem to like those. Under, those prices are high. Okay, so. D um, day breaks. They were disrespected. Them first, we the shoe is tight. Like, I don't like the like. I didn't. Store, but every time I see somebody wearing them, I'm like, whatever dang, it is. them joints is kind of they are. The, right. the blue ones I saw someone wearing and they're fire. But I, if I got them, I think I would bla break that plastic off. I don't get it. No, What's the point? Ain't nobody breaking none old brand new items. That's what you wear to uh, Area Fifty One. Yeah, those suck. Them NASA's. Uh, that Air might Max be a sign. Two Air Max 200, the women's colorway, to me, is fire. I know Simple said trash. You said you liked it. Air that Max one right 200. There, Let me see. This one or this one? That one's tight. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Not the black one, but the yellow and the green one. I mean, I, li I, I like them both. I like that one, though. I just the want to touch The whole Pharrell Air Solar HU Glide, whatever pack comes out. Fire. Oh, eh. Those are fire. <coughs> Those aren't fire. I, mean, I don't know why that model is disrespected like the way it is. That's a great model. Well, you disrespected Boost a long time ago, so everybody probably heard you and was like, nah, we don't I've probably bought more Boost than you recently. Like, what are you talking about? You might be right, but that doesn't mean you're not disrespecting Boost on the show. I have never disrespected Boost. You talking down about Boost from up here and then to here is disrespecting. All right. Because it did go from up here to That's here. fine. But I talk about Adidas models being trash and how they didn't utilize Boost correctly. Just That's how I talk about okay. it. Just because you buy Boost doesn't mean you're not disrespecting it when you talk about it. No, right? no, no. I, I, disres I, I said Adidas hey, disrespected you need to stop themselves. Buying boost you're in trouble right now. So. <laughs> Bought Boost. Right. Not buying Boost. OG Triple Black. 
Nineteens come out. Hannah got Ultra Boost Nineteens, right? Yeah, she said I, they're the best one. I need a pair of in those in terms so. of comfort. Whatever. I just need them for like eighty eight dollars though. None of them have gotten to that level because I'm trying to get one for that. Some joints. I'm sorry. When I looked at them at Nordstrom's, I was like, these joints are fire in hand. Yeah, they look. They look nice. Uh, women's Zumex Vista Grind. You could say uh, fire. We've out, been man. talking about that shoe. You're every trying week. so hard not to say fire, dude. It's gonna oh, that still didn't come out. I thought it came it out. Depends on what you're talking about. If it did come out. out. Yeah, the. Uh, it did come out on Nike. They came out on North. Ultra Boost 19 or wow. no. upper. Uh, uh, what is it? Uh, upper echelon? No. no um, upper tier? <laughs> <laughs> above average. Oh. I'm not going to say they're fire. They're above oh, average. They're fire. Um, that's pretty much it. Uh, don't lack luster week. No, John Scott Lowe's. Travis Scott Lowe's come out. No, the twentieth. Oh, is that this week? Yeah, that's this week. That's Sunday, right? Oh, sorry, Travis Scott. Said lack luster. Oh, and then I, NASA no. PG three fiftieth anniversary. Okay, you can stop there. That's what, that's, what, that's what you wear to Area fifty one. Any of that pack. Yeah, this says they come out on the twentieth, but there has been zero hype about it coming out. So how the hell we know it's actually coming out? I mean, I've seen a. I've seen a few I've people doing nothing. in-hand reviews. Shout out to International O from Stinker Tribune. Oh, he well, he could send us pairs in. I don't know if he got that. No, he's the one that we'll talk about that in a little bit. Um, so we good on that. What else we doing? We doing top ten fast food restaurants and everyone. To us. Everyone's gonna be angry about our list. We already know this. It's impossible no, to be angry about listen, your list. Uh, there are a lot of I fast guarantee food restaurants. You came in last, like I said you would. I didn't come in first, which is fine. It seems everyone likes Anna's. When you look online at Anna's on the screen, it looks very nice. <laughs> You did her a favor by putting it in the middle. I think it's a bias. She was in the middle. That's fine. Pause. Isn't it needed? Or? Look. <laughs> I won. Once you listen Easy. and look. Asterisk. Jay, there was no official voting. Anna and Jay clearly no. had. What? Yeah, Man, they did. What? It was clearly. Jay's list is awful. It was clearly better than ours. too awful. To, maybe fine, but it was. they were better than ours. No, that was, was it. No, I stand for my list still. Okay. Now, there was two mistakes on my list. When I went back and watched, I was like, how did I let Greg pick that Soulfly shoe and I picked the oh. size Don? If I would have picked the Soulfly Jordan 1 instead of the Don in that spot. <laughs> I don't know where you would go with that anyway. Because I was going to pick it. Now, okay. And yeah. then when you picked it, that's why I picked Arsham 4D. That's now, I, I think Arsham 4D still be should belong on there. But the size it's Don, if I would have got that like round 10 then i would have been more happy i think definitely next year the money's gonna be about two thousand dollars and i went back and watched you coming back to az no. in the summer next year <laughs> uh, we'll see it shouldn't be that low but it should be like three thousand or it should be low 3500 or it something it should be like eight hundred dollars to see what we can really uh, do we right. got my slides and stuff yes, oh. okay that, nobody I, wants to see that. that one year that one year i almost bought slides just. now 2007, 2017 thing i went back and watched it after we did the show the amount of fire that came out of this is what I said. Okay, that's fine. 2016 too. Relax. The very first one we did, unreal fire. Yes, you're right, but we also picked, I picked black and red ones first. Like, that's not like an exciting pick. Yes, it should be first, but it's not like. Yes, four oh, years later, it's not exciting. Was there always the a dollar is, limit? There you, wasn't always a dollar no, limit. No, not the first time. The okay. second time, yes. There was only a third time of doing it. I thought it was our fourth time. The first it. time we did it, it was an abomination because we had a board of paper <laughs> that he wrote up there. Now, I, I give Greg boards. credit for... for uh, I don't even think I watched that one. Editing that in. To it, it sucks. So. <laughs> the past right. episodes, those are cringeworthy. I'd be like, oh, Okay. <laughs> I never said it was better than 2017. You're saying it's worst of all time. We can't go that far. It's just like aliens. We don't know. All right, we have to go. Back. <laughs> no, we, we have to go way back in time. Sneakers. And the other sneakers thing about saying out. the first six months, yes, but you would have to go do the research. Is my point. You can't oh, just remember off the top. Of your, how are you gonna remember off the top of your head every single well, year when shoes came out here. to know if it's better? We literally come here every week and talk sneakers. And we also we come here every week these. and you say I know nothing. So <laughs> you gotta yeah, make like, a decision. I got you know? mixed up when John Wilkes Booth. Went and to the then, theater. Okay, uh, well, you say you know nothing about shoes. And then you also have been starting this thing with Andy Green about the first six months of this year being better than last year. We haven't even done a draft yet. I bet you we go do a draft and we'll be like, oh, you know what? It might not no, be as good as we thought. No. You so high the, off the acronyms. What's years. those called? What's the... All right. What's Sakai's? The, yeah, you so acronyms. high off those. Uh, Very high. Uh, Matter of fact, in 2017 draft, I think I got... Clop Vapor Max in like round seven. That's how fire it was. Oh, it's not working. Yep. That's how, that's that's how fire it was. Anyways, what are we talking about? 
Are we gonna talk about Jordan Four shot drop yet? Are we still in the camera? I was gonna, camera? I, like I, I was gonna say it at the end of the thing for like shoes that came out, but I figured you want the glory. So what's the glory of your shock drop? Are we all not saying, it or you just want me to yell at this time? I didn't time? say it last time I'm either. To... I faked right. like I, I said, said it. it last time. I thought we were all gonna say it. <clears throat> no, well, I've I ne- fake I've it. never yelled it out. Man, you one of them. Faking. I am. I went like <laughs> this, and then you look like I said it. Like, it yeah. might cut out now, so it really did. <laughs> Do it. Oh. Are we talking about it now? <laughs> yes. Can I yell shock drop or are you all going to yell shock drop? Yeah, you, yeah, I'm not yelling anything. Fine. I'm going to do the yelling. I'm the only one here who wants them for the toe. So I don't think Anna wants them. For the I toe? Know you don't. Personal pair, whatever to wear. What you say? For the toe. What the heck does that mean? What does it mean? For the toe? To put on your feet and wear. <laughs> oh, you mean for your actual toes? When did you start talking like this? Have you been watching YouTube? Are you watching YouTube videos today? Why you start talking like this? Huh? Oh, are you on social media? You want or? them for the toe? You mean your feet? The toe? I thought you was. A, I thought you was an acronym. Yeah. I thought you said. <laughs> Can I hear shock like, drop? Like YOLO? Did you come in here with a? Did you get a have a a brain contusion today? You know what is wrong with you? Can I yell shock drop? I told you five minutes ago. I'm literally yes. about to yell it about okay, three ready? or four times. Think somebody is dying in here. <laughs> That's how you do when you lose your virginity. <laughs> you be a bell. I do not want that vision. Yeah. That's my first time. <laughs> yes, and then you light up a uh, cool. <laughs> yes, a Newport. A cool. <laughs> light up a cool. A Marlboro. Was it good for you? My first time. Uh, <laughs> Uh, for you. They are very nice. Those suck. Jordan Four Cool Grays are one of the most overrated like, like Jordans it. of all time. I mean, people will be on your back again for saying that, so that's fine with me. No, there's a lot more people that posted it that I I was shocked that they were like, I don't really care for these, but they cool. Like I, they're not. They're not cool. They've never been cool. People are gonna be on your back again. So all right, those are not. Like, you're not going to like them when you get them. I don't know do why you, you want them so why bad. Why are you, you saying that like I've never... They came out in 2004. Like, you don't think I've never seen them before in person? You're not going to want these. Dude, you don't want Kobe 4s now. There's a difference between back well, then what? and now. No, what Kobe I think they look really nice. That's worthy of buying. Maybe, I'm not going to buy them. Uh, the maybe Carpe Diems. Maybe. I'm not paying full price for those. Okay, what Kobe 4 are you waiting for? I'm not wait, necessarily waiting for anything, but like that undefeated that came out, that joint is completely glossy. You think I'm buying that? Like, you don't think they look <laughs> okay. nice? That joint is the color of your hat and glossy. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? The joints are tight, though. The, the, the color on those is tight. The, exactly. I said somebody can see me, and then I'll wear them. Pause. And it is right, though. The, they the look release, nice the right picture, there. The guy, homeboy, made them look tight. You and Simple were talking about how that's why they sold out because of the picture. No, oh, no, no, no. I didn't say so- that. Yes, you did. Simple you said that. I didn't whatever. say that's why. They sold out because early releases, people can flip. That's the only reason. Did you get a pair? No. Why do you? I didn't. I wasn't looking at my phone. Nobody told us they were going to shock drop. Yeah, what's up, man? No, one person. Like, uh, usually one. Sock, sock Jig said that, like, even in the monitor groups he's in, a lot of people didn't win. Like, that knew about was coming out and still didn't win. I didn't even see where to buy it. Like, I didn't know you had to go through the pictures to buy it. I'm like, yo, where is this joint? Act. Oh, see, that was my question because was so annoying. Nerds, nerd twenty three and nerd sneaker Twitter had the picture ahead of time, knew it was going to come out. It said oh, yeah. seven fifty. It came on the monitor at seven forty six, but I didn't wasn't looking at my phone. I was getting dropped off at work. I had it in my pocket, and I didn't look till I got upstairs. It was already gone. It was that early. Oh, I've never been that early. Oh, on the monitor it. Oh, Nike yeah, yeah, sneakers yeah. updated at 7:46, and then on the picture it said 7:50 a.m. that they tweeted. Uh, so I was like, "Why did Nike tell people in advance that it was going to be a shock drop?" If people were paying attention, that is. I was like, "It was nothing on there about Cool Grizz on the app the entire time, like whatsoever." And I forgot to check. So I was going to check the monitor thing, and I was like, "Ah, oh, whatever." Like once it actually dropped, I thought it was a joke, like because everybody kept saying, "All oh, cap." Whatever lie, whatever that means, and I'm like, okay, but people kept pushing pictures of got him, so then I'm going through the pictures. I'm like, yo, uh-huh. all it is is this dude. It was like on what the third pick 
Like it was on multiple, so if you kept going, it would pop up in various times. Oh, what? Oh, see, I only yeah, saw it more than oh, one. You had that open. Yeah, like I kept clicking, but I I would just click 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 to the very end. Yeah, you had to like click it and like kind of let it sit there a bit, and then the thing popped and it said sold out. I was like, God dang it! So I only saw it on one pick. I, I never saw it on another. One. I got on there and there still was like a 14, 15, 16, 17 left or something. Uh, but I don't obviously don't want that. So well, I think them joints are. Overrated whack and they'll sit when they drop. That's fine. I mean, are I, you copying for full I, price? I told him that because you know he was like, people are just buying early to flip. I said no, duh. I'm like <laughs> I mean, no one's, ain't nobody running out to cop those when they come out. Now it's the first time they're re- uh, releasing in 15 years, so who knows? Maybe it'll be a little bit different Damn, than like oldest. something else that released early that people went crazy about. Um, the fact that black red fours right now are basically retail, I guess in some sizes they're a little bit more than retail or whatever. It kind of tells me that no one will care about cool grays. I would like to get them under retail. What was? What I don't was, think I want to pay full price for them. What was retail? What's full price on them? Two twenty. I mean, I'm assuming one ninety. Oh, it, it can't, can't be two twenty. Two twenty was the fours, right? The black red fours. <clears throat> I Is think. it on there? I don't know. Those were. I could get a pair of black red fours from like I catch them every once in a while and go stock is for like two thirty five. Right? Yeah. So I don't I mean, know what I can't remember what retail is. Ten dollars. Go. You got to pay ten dollars shipping or whatever. StockX. You got to pay tax and shipping because it's here. Because it's here in Arizona. I'm like, man, y'all need to go. It's only good it's here in Arizona because I can ship faster. But when yeah, you cop one ninety. <laughs> um. Yeah. One ninety, fam. Oh, like I said, I don't know why it's like the cat has camel pants on. Like I don't know why y'all but they got look, so excited. What are you crazy? They, they look, look good. Quiet. Yeah, they look good. Like with that right there it looks made like, me think. It looks like he should be in a tree though, hunting okay. <laughs> jackalopes though. Whatever, right. whatever we got in jackalope. Whatever we got in Arizona. It him wearing those. I mean, I'm easily influenced by somebody who knows how to wear something correctly because. Okay, I'll put it this way. I don't think the shoe. I don't think the shoe is trash. It's just not my favorite. It's not even like close to a favorite to me. Like out of the fours, and the fact that you have probably the greatest Jordan four of all time and haven't wore it yet is insane to me. All right, like I don't know what you're waiting for. Though. Like sneaker kind of come back. I have no. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea what you're waiting for. You got any Jordan fours? I think winter time. Honestly, I don't. Well, okay. Because I'm not trying to dress like super hot clothes, I and I don't want to wear right? fours with shorts. I, Weird. I wasn't sure Unless if I wanted six the... Nine, I, I wasn't sure now if I wanted... Now 6'9 at NYPD? Sorry. Now 6'9 at NYPD could wear those with shorts. <laughs> oh, yeah. Anyways, she was there, too, right? With that tall man? Oh, yeah, 6'9, a waiter. He's only 6'7. <laughs> our waiter guy at the bar. Oh, yeah, 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 him. Yeah, 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 yeah. okay. And Anna's mad at me because I've cut her off. Now I can't remember what I was going to say. You said you oh. don't got Jordan Fords. I don't. Well, I was going to. I didn't know if I wanted the black reds. And then um, I have somebody just holding them. And I'm like, maybe I'll get them. I don't know. They're still holding them now? You got yes. mad at me to say that. <laughs> <laughs> to say that. <laughs> Someone's been holding them for about a year and a half. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. They came out this year, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah okay. So angry. God, I feel like so long ago. I should sell mine. I just Anyone feel weird today. disrespect my grails. All right. Yeah, we're going to talk about grills, too. Um, Westbrook traded. Did we talk about that? No. No, because it didn't happen yet. Oh. We talked about, we talked about Kawhi Paul George and, and Paul Kawhi. George. Yeah, we talked about all the other crazy stuff. What? But that's the craziest trade okay. by far, bar none. Wait, wait. The trade is crazy or like crazy? Like, yo, like oh, crazy. Oh, no, yo. Okay. What's the, Vegas line for Rockets? There's finals? only two Supermax contracts in the NBA. Yeah. One is Russ. And Chris and Wall. One, no. One is um, John Wall. Okay. Yeah, Trading yeah. a Supermax contract, everyone thought would be impossible. John Wall never get traded because he's owed money to the end of the earth and he sucks. So John Wall doesn't suck. Hurt sucks. Whatever. Hurts you know and what I mean. unhappy. Okay, whatever. Yes, he might go somewhere else and then he's high school John Wall again. Who knows? I <laughs> doubt it. But <laughs> dunking on everybody. John Wall has a dunk in the NBA and who knows how long he Stop looks it. like he yes, weighs a hundred pounds more than he did when he was in high school. You haven't seen John Wall play in a while. Yes, he does weigh more than he does in high school. Okay. Now you was in college. Relax, All right. Right. Um neither one of Actually, I, I don't – Westbrook was not good efficiently last season. He no. was good – again, I think he maybe had a triple-double or something, but he was like the least efficient high uh, high um, usage player in NBA history, something like that. So we, I think people kind of knew like if once they got rid of 
Paul George, it was like they were oh, yeah. trying actively to get rid of him too. But they said that they were trying before they got rid of Paul George. Like someone said they were trying to trade to the Raptors for Kawhi. Well, I mean, you if you get an offer or if you want oh, to make it's an not offer, working. If you get an offer, you're gonna make it. You're gonna listen. Right. But they say he was um, heated about it. That doesn't surprise me. Now he him for Chris Paul is crazy, and a a, a large <laughs> sum of draft picks. So they got what four from them? Five, three? They got three uh, first round draft picks. I have no idea how many draft many. picks they got. It was a lot. From now, from 2020 to 2026, they had 15 George, first for, round picks. What's the name? No, no, no. They got what? It was something for. It wasn't a straight up Chris Paul Westbrook. I don't know what the yeah, deal. Yeah, yeah. There was something else in there, but it wasn't a lot of picks because those guys are fairly even. Why would you? Why would it be a lot of picks? Wait, what do you mean? What you mean, mean money wise, even? right? Because you don't mean play wise. I mean. Westbrook. Based on last year, they're not as big as much a difference in age as people think. Chris Paul's thirty four, Westbrook's thirty or thirty one. Like it's not. And Westbrook's that old? Well, yeah. It was like yeah, bro. He was came in the same league 30. as Kevin Love. He did play for the, the Supersonics too. <laughs> seven draft or two thousand eight draft? Was it whatever? one year? Two di- two years with the Supersonics? Um, do they go to the finals? Does who? The Rockets? Houston? No. The finals? Okay, good. Yeah. I don't know about the finals. I don't know how it's going to work out between he and Harden together. Yeah, they both need the ball in there. Me and Bruce have a bet that he's betting that the Rockets are going to the finals. All right. Well, Bruce didn't tell us Cool Grays were shot dropping. All right, so I should have bet Bruce. him like some sneakers. Like whatever he gets retail, he should. we should do that. Let me try to figure out what this trade is. I was trying to look for it too. Um, I said the Rockets trade for Chris Paul. Oh, two first-round picks and two pick swaps. So the Rockets gave Chris Paul two first round picks and two pick swaps. That's crazy for one player. Which uh, he's worth it. I mean, it's Westbrook. Westbrook's like I said, he's gonna be the greatest athlete of all time to never won a championship. And he's going to the Rockets now? <laughs> yeah, protected first round picks. I mean, those joints might not come out till Who you got? That's the craziest with? thing about like one of the things I saw somebody was Tweet like an NFL writer was tweeting how the NBA is crazy because you would never see trades like this in the NFL. Said so the NBA collective bargaining agreement allows teams to protect those picks by number, by draft position. If the NFL allowed NFL teams to do that, it would work exactly the same way. Teams would be trading because the NFL, as you know, doesn't go crazy like Major League Baseball to trade deadline or the NBA. No no season will ever be like the, this NBA offseason. But the NFL is known as the one league that doesn't have a lot of crazy trades for like superstars. Like you're not seeing Tom Brady traded or Aaron Rodgers or nothing like that. The Khalil Mack trade was like the craziest trade in that NFL history. Yeah, I've seen a long time but ever. It's because their, their rules don't allow for the same kind of things. You would see this. If you could trade four, three, four first round picks and say – if those picks are in the first 20 picks, oh, yeah, it's yeah, protected. Yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, You don't get them until the next year, and then it's like, you know, eight top 18 and then top 16. If you don't get them for 10 years, <laughs> then oh, you're right. then it, then they're, the value goes down. Like, NFL, you know what year you're getting the pick. It's not protected by draft position. So that's why the NBA can get away with that shit. Like, the Rockets or uh, who got Paul George again? Clippers, Clippers gave all those picks up, but the, a lot of them are protected. They might not get those picks for 10 years. Yeah, they said it could take up to I mean, they said to 2026. That's what they said. That's so. what the pick year goes through. Because another NBA rule is you can't trade back-to-back year first-round picks. You can't. You're not allowed what? to. Yeah, you can't. Oh, I didn't know that. That's yeah. kind of crazy. So if you trade 2021, you can't also trade 2022. You have to. You, they Ooh, have to skip a year. Yeah, I didn't know you that. You have to skip. You can 2023. Your mic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dang it. I think my mic's been on the entire time. It was. Oh, yeah, that's, I didn't know that. I didn't know you could do that. So, no, they ain't making the finals, in my opinion. Are they better than the Clippers? Um, I don't think so. I think the Clippers end, like, the end of a game roster was going to be the best defense in the NBA oh, yeah. and almost nearly impossible to score on. Having Paul They're George, like, Kawhi, and Beverly. Last eight is minutes of the fourth crazy. quarter. Uh, They're going to be so annoying, the teams. Uh, the yeah, but play. against, and you got in like, the people, people. Yeah, people will be upset they have to play him. It's not going to be annoying to me because oh, yeah. Patrick Beverly is annoying to most people, at least the ones who aren't Clip I fans. I love Patrick Beverly. But, like, Kawhi, to me, is not an annoying player. I like watching Kawhi. So. No, I love watching Kawhi. Now, watching Kawhi on the Spurs is a little dry, but, like, yeah, because Kawhi, Kawhi is, yeah, that's, just, that's just them. But, no, watching Kawhi is, like, 
especially during that Sixers series, it was just so smooth, like, and it's so effortless. Like, I was like, dang, man, all he did was just dribble twice and turn around and shoot it. Like, he makes basketball look like, like, hey, man, just put the ball in the hoop. Like, he don't make it look like everybody. Westbrook, you watch Westbrook play, and I, I love Russell Westbrook. But you watch Russell Westbrook play, play, you would think that basketball is the hardest He's thing working. on earth. Like, he is working hard. <laughs> Quiet come down, he body you a little bit, turn around, and walk back down the course. Like, the goal was just to put the ball in the hoop and go back and get the ball again. Um, George, you want to do true crime now? Hold on a second. I'm trying to look and see. Come on, we got other topics. What are you talking about? True what else crime? we got? I can't think of anything else. I got the the other thing. Man, there's a lot of stuff to talk about. Hold on a second. Well, we only got. All about- right, so the Warriors will be minimized, obviously, at least until Clay comes back. The Nuggets are probably going to be above average, but I don't think they'll be the two seed again. Portland's going to be right back, assuming his Jokic is healthy. I mean, Jokic, and they did get Whitehead, depending on where his mean head's at, Nurkic? and Lillard. Oh, sorry, Nurkic, Nurkic, yeah, yeah, my Nurkic. bad. Uh, Nuggets be back? back, huh? Nuggets be just as good. They're not going to be the two seed, but they'll be in the playoffs. They made zero changes. Oh, they got rid of uh, Isaiah Thomas. <laughs> Where did he go? Uh, He's the Wizards. Somebody. I don't know if they made zero Wizards. changes, but the they Wizards. still have their core. They got right Gary Harris, um, the Jamal guard, Murray, yeah, Murray and Jokic, still, and they so. got Bobo. So. I still think about Bobo. Bobo. Why not even play next year? B O W L. Bobo or B O W L. That had me dying. Uh, the Rockets were the four seed, so they'll they'll still be there. I don't know if they'll they they have the opportunity to move up. Obviously, a team that comes out of the playoffs. Spurs. Utah is going to be really good because Utah signed one of the most underrated players of the offseason, Bojan Bogdanovic or whatever. Oh, That's going to be okay. A crazy. And good Michael Conley is really them. good, but Conley has health issues. But he's a really good point guard. Bogdanovich from yes. which Bogdanovich? I always get them mixed up. Indiana. They have the same name. He was in Indiana. Yeah. Okay, the year. older one. Um, the Thunder out. The Thunder were the sixth seed, so they're trash. See, uh, the Spurs, you never know. They got Popovich still, so they'll probably yeah, make the playoffs. Right. Clippers were the eighth seed. They you should know, one be two or one, three. yeah. Like, and the Clippers didn't make the play. I mean, the Lakers didn't make the playoffs. And they'll be so. Oh, Mavericks got, could come you up. You got there. a lot of things. I think Mavs. Pelicans can- are going to be super fun to watch. Memphis is going to be super fun to watch. They could throw wrenches and stuff. I think Memphis and Pelicans are going to be fun to watch, but I don't know if they'll be winning, though. Like, I think they'll just be super fun to Pelicans watch. Pelicans' like, entire draft class is – I mean, I, we knew Zion, but that one cat was, like, not the MVP of the summer league, but he was number two. Oh, yeah. Like, Zion going to stay healthy, though. Yeah, he'll be fine. Zion needs to get in shape. shape. <laughs> yeah, he needs to get in shape, though. Like, he's, he's definitely been living a lifestyle, a different lifestyle now. Um I think the Mavericks could get in the playoffs. And Sacramento almost got in the playoffs last year. Sacramento the fought for the, the A Mavericks spot. Just, just give Num Nuts $90 million? <laughs> Who? What's the name? Um, Opted out of that $30 million and whatever, uh, and they gave him 89 a, He used to be on the Warriors. Yeah, I can't think of his name. North Harris. North Harrison. Carolina man. Harrison. Barnes. Harrison, Harrison Barnes. Barnes. Yeah. Um, yeah, but they got. They nothing. still got the T Wolves. Might be uh, something no, too. They, they were will. 11 seed. Wait, Harrison We've thought Barnes? that for a long time. <laughs> yeah, but they never will. Cat finally is like this. No, Cat is, but Cat can't do it by himself. They need a point guard. Uh, yeah, let me, let me. Losing Jimmy, having Jimmy Butler at some point during your season, and you still only got the 11 seed. Like I know he got traded midway through, but it's like, yo, they should have been way better. They needed, they need Russell off of. Uh, they need a point guard. They got a shot. No, they don't got a shot. The Timberwolves. No, they don't. No, they have Andrew Wiggins. That's like. Their only other guy. Although I seen a no, stat Wiggins about him, is terrible. I seen so a stat about him that was a little shocking. That he's like scored the most points. That's all he does. There's only been like four players that scored more points than him in the last like five years or something yeah, like but that. He, he's That's all he does. He doesn't play. I know. I mean, look. I, I'm like I'm not Ryan with him. I'm like you know. Yeah. I, all right. Look. He, he's the lowest efficiency player who's with that high of usage in NBA history, possibly. I Mavericks like- are the team to look for. No, I'm. I'm t- they'll get an AC. They'll get AC. No, they won't. Why not? They I got read to you all the teams, and there's like 10, 11 Damn, teams they for got the eight spots. Porzingis. Without they them got even being homeboy. there. You assume Porzingis is going to be the same. I, I mean, yeah. I assume everybody's going to be the same when they take two years off. He gets hurt all the time. Uh, I mean, this one was a major one, but he does little t- tweaks here and there. I mean, he's freaking seven feet tall doing yeah, stuff chill, he got no business bro. doing. Timberwolves four and in summer league B. <laughs> okay, Sacramento Kings won the like summer league like two years in a row. I like De'Aaron summer. Fox. <laughs> Love De'Aaron yeah, Fox. Like he should have been a Phoenix Sun. Oh, they picked Culver. Yeah, Minnesota. He's gonna be good. Well, we'll see. He's gonna be a star, but he's gonna be good. And so they got he, Tyus Jones too. Homeboy on the Bulls. 
Oh, wait, that. no. Oh, they traded Tyus Jones Tyus to Memphis? Jones or? Was on oh, he signed an offer the offer sheet. Yeah, 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 but he signed an offer sheet with the Grizzlies. See, I'm telling you, Memphis, though. Mm. It's going to be fan fun to watch. Of course. They never use Tyus Jones. I don't know why. Oh, it's because Thibodeau's not. Cool. Oh, yeah, never mind. Minnesota. <laughs> Cattle have cattle have too many minutes on his legs by game yeah, sixty three. Cat signed a big contract one year, right? Or could he be gone somewhere? I don't soon? know if his oh. rookie deal's even up yet. I think this is only year four, right? It's this something is, like that. Yeah, this is fourth year. God bless him. The Timberwolves need to be uh to get decimated. To get rid of the team, the, the, the franchise. Union Jordan four. Oh, I don't know much about. It. I, I read the thing with the yeah. Nordstrom, whatever. So, is there gonna be a Jordan four? Yeah, they said they're working That's on it. That saying. was the owner of Union who was commenting. I don't, you know, or are you copying? <laughs> <laughs> the thing, like, it's so crazy that, like, I mean, obviously we got a sneaker podcast, we got to talk about it, but talking about stuff that, like, I mean, doing a Jordan one, arguably the far, most fire model of all time, a Jordan four, arguably the greatest Jordan of all time, you could argue that, like, and you have no chance of getting it. I hate this. <laughs> like I absolutely hate it. They're like I can't stand knowing that already pre knowing that I'm not gonna get it. And then I hate trying <laughs> and like feeling like I got a shot every like when you start trying, you genuinely feel like like telling people like, oh I'm copping. If if you said you saying that, I would have said, Oh, I'm gonna cop the four. I'm definitely copping. No, what? No, oh, no, you pass. you always say I'm copping, regardless of what the shoe is. Oh, you know what? You always say gonna, that. I was gonna say something earlier. <laughs> I was gonna say Cause somebody was like, "Yo, I feel like we got cheated on pickups for Greg." Cause he's probably trying to hide a lot. I will say something. I did have two cause blacks. That's what I will say. <laughs> what? Um, what? You won two raffles? Uh, yeah, I had two cause black fours. I did say that, but I didn't say that because I didn't want nobody asking for it. You won the second raffle. You oh, I did. I Oscar's used different. Name? I did a different email and stuff with that. <laughs> Every week I'll reveal a, a new sneaker secret. <laughs> like what? Every week I'll reveal a new sneaker secret. I did what have two cars for a boy. You had two cars. That's why I was and fine. I lost. That's why I was fine with trading the one for the off white one, and then I sold the other one to StockX. <laughs> All right. You know, you guys asked for it. Uh, what are we talking about? Gianna's going to Africa. I can't. mean, I mean, hold on. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not mad that like you had two and you didn't offer me one because you know I would do the same thing. I would be greedy and oh, sell it. I'm not mad about that. I'm just mad that you got two and I got zero. And I, I got put Hannah's one when it ended. Two, I think. I got the one. It was already over, and I was like, "How did I get an email saying they shipped it?" And then the other one, I got the email. Didn't even know I got the email. I was like, "Man!" And then I got an email, and I was like, "This ended a long time ago." I was like, "Oh, they must have messed up." Got that one. And then the other one, I just scrolled through my email like, what the fuck? I got two. Did they both show up at the same day? Yeah, I got them both. In two different boxes or one box? Different boxes. <laughs> I used two different cards and two different emails. Now, I, I was worried because it was the same address, but. It, they, they got there. They got there. So, but I'll tell you, there's at least four more sneaker secrets <laughs> that are like. One of them's kind of big, I'll tell you that. You think that one's shocking. <laughs> There's one that, like, I didn't tell nobody. In terms bro. of what? Like. Now, if we got a check for the sneak disc and you didn't give me some money, oh, then right. I would be heated. Settle <laughs> down. Then I would be heated. I would never do something like that. Don't ever accuse me of something okay. like that. How dare you? I accuse anyone. How dare you? I said if. What are we I mean, talking about? You were mentioning Giannis. No, George no? said he was copping Jordan for unions. Oh yeah, I'm gonna try. Yeah, and then, oh. he, then are you I, kidding me? It's a Jordan Four, bro. If they mix, if it's anything like what they did on the first collab, if they mix, and like, I don't care what the price is after, bread, I'm telling Hannah, I'm, unless it's a thousand uh, immediately, I'm buying. Okay. If it's like six hundred, I'm buying. All right, because cool. we know in three, five, six months it'd be a thousand anyways. Oh no, no, no. If, yeah, no, no. Facts. If we could get them for five, fifty, six hundred, seven hundred dollars, I'm telling Rocio we're buying as many as we possibly can. <laughs> <laughs> because they're gonna be about eighteen hundred dollars. Like everybody's gonna be waiting for that. Travis, I hope Travis Scott Lowe's are like six hundred or something like that, and then uh, buy some of those. Oh, no, oh, they're not. No, available. they're like eleven hundred right now. Oh, oh, they are. Oh, okay. Yeah. So when they drop, if they're like seven, you buy. Well, I'm hopefully I get about seven pairs on release. All right. <laughs> Retail. I have no idea. I mean, you out here coming two uh, joints? Uh, what are you talking about? An accident. 
Accident. Yeah, it's an accident. Car shit those. Uh. You know, I had a monitor back then too. That's the other secret. I had a, I had one back then. <laughs> Hope the artist come fight me. You know? I'll scrap them in the studio and you can film it. The artist. Um, the artist known as whatever cause real name is. Do you got a true crime? Man, we got another topic. What do you mean what true else? crime? We got like no? three more other topics. We, no, can, we, we don't. Can, bruh, I want to talk about said, the grill thing. Wiki? I want to talk about the grill thing. We got fast food and we got, I mean, we'll talk about Giannis for so a second. So why do you keep asking me? Who? Giannis? 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 What? His shoe? Coming to America? Y'all copping? Oh, man. No. That's super trash. Huh? I guess that the was the movie. Giannis. Fire and I can't wait till they do it. Movie's one. the greatest movie of all time. To me. Uh, okay. To me. My fine. favorite movie of all time. Not the greatest movie of all time. My it favorite movie of all time. It is a great movie. I think my favorite movie list would be Good. way dramatically different than everybody else's. Uh, because Ocean's Eleven is definitely in my top ten. That's in my top ten. Time. Oh, okay. Coming to America, I'm trying to think if it's in my top, top ten. Top ten of what? Of like all my, movies. Favorite, my personal favorite okay, movies. Okay, so of all not time. necessarily like not, best movie. Yeah, not You're, like I oh, feel like right. worldwide. No, 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 no. All right. I feel there's plenty of movies that are like better than that. Like well, why we didn't talk about this at the time, I have no idea. But the what? Cortez pack, Shoe Dog pack comes out. Why we didn't talk about that? You literally the Cortez fiend. So I don't know why. Are you copping? No, but it's important. I mean, why is it important? Because the pack is like the original three oh, logos yeah, yeah. that supp supposedly could have been Nike. Like, can you imagine if it was a circle or a whatever that, <laughs> whatever that, whatever that yeah, falcon that is? Though I love those. Now, no, you don't. What are you nuts? No one loves. No one loves those. I've heard so much slander off this pack. The lo those two other logos are so bad. Slander from people who probably weren't even alive. Okay. Mm, no, I think Russ Bankston actually was one of the pre people slandering that pack. Russ Bankston can... I don't. I, I have no care of his sneaker opinion. Now, if he wants to talk about politics That's and yell at Trump all day, not very nice. cool. All right. All right. I, I'll, he could chill out. I'll be talking to Russ on Twitter, though. Huh? Yeah, all right. Yeah, y'all be going back and forth about Trump administration. No, you were the one going back and forth with me on nonsense. Huh? No, you were going back and forth on me on nonsense. Huh? I sent the original tweet. Look, that dog pack of Cortez's is absolute fire. And, it's, and every sneakerhead should cop. Stop saying absolute if fire. You're a, Stop saying absolute fire to me. If you're a sneakerhead and you were born between 80 and, and 89. Now, this one is okay. It's better than, to me than the Falcon. That's the though. least favorite one. That wow. looks like the Philippines. No offense. So. <laughs> <laughs> it looks Every like a, week. You saying that just because the man said, like you'll never try me in front of the Why Hague. Did you hear like about that? The Philippines. The circle. Something about the circle looks like the flag. That's Japan. Oh, no. The Philippines has a I know star. What you're saying. It's a, three, a star and the, the yellow. Sun with the three and the stars. Sun. Did you hear what, about that? What? The president said, I will never be tried in front of the Hague. Who said that? The president of the Philippines. He's he's crazy. He is. He's nuts. But yeah. that's what he was. The no, Hague has the, the world court. So if you get charged with like um, sexual assault, what's wrong? That's a crime. No, like genocide type stuff. Oh, get, I don't know stuff about that. Go to the Hague. Huh? Oh, hey, what? Try out here. Huh? <laughs> Try yes. What's so that anyways, movie with? Uh, like, I'll never be. So I was telling you. They, okay, have you not been reading about what's happening in the Philippines? No, or? not the Philippines. Oh, okay. right. Well, I, I don't really. Anna can let you know one. I don't. Days. No, I don't. I don't really. I'm um, sure you know about the drug crackdown. Disrespectful about the Philippines. Yes, but there. you said he's crazy, so you obviously know something. Yes, he is crazy. She'll fill you in. I've only been reading about our own country's politics lately. Are oh. you copping this pack? If I could, <laughs> I would. <laughs> But I will later. He's got too many secrets already. See, here's the thing. You know what I'm gonna start doing? No, that's not a bad no, let's secret. Do that. That's a thing. Like you literally sold one for a thousand, probably. Like, what are you talking about? But that. But then I bought more than the end. Just... Yeah, you absolutely right. It's a vicious cycle. Rocio knew the truth. That you'd be out on the street. Why are you? Why are you gotta take it too far? Bro? Like, why you gotta go so far Look with it? Bro? I told you I got two. That was it. You gotta throw all that out there. Well, she already knew that. Now that you said it, you oh, it's said too it late now. Uh, I told her too. I said, you know, I feel so relieved that that burden is off me. Oh my god! Bro, you have no idea. Bro, how you you gotta tell I another one then. I know it was four. I'm not waiting four weeks for these stories. I'm not waiting four wait, weeks for these uh, stories. Gotta, so just tell them one more. No, you gotta you can do two and two. You gotta wait. That's fine. Nope, that's my thing. And instead of pickups, I'm gonna do. What I'm going to cop yes, once I'm out sales. of the doghouse. Yes, I'm, I'm going to do future pickups. Pickups and sales. I'm going to do future cops. That's what I'm going to do. So God. you can do what you resold. <laughs> I do future cops. Man. What else are we talking you about? Tell me the true other crime? thing. True crime? Yeah, let's do true crime. 
Um, Before we talk about the girl thing and fast food. Or do you want to talk about the girl thing right do now? Do the girl thing first. We'll do the girl thing. The so, fast food is a topic to because we need to do, like, what's the best, like, fries? What's the best burger? What's the best taco? Whatever. We got Your list is going to be so confusing because I know everything you got on there. Nobody probably has any idea what this stuff is. No. It's not. It's a regular list. I did. Oh, right. I, found, I found a list of, like, all the, like, main fast food in America and only picked from that list specifically. So okay, good. No. Because I was like, I know George is going to pick a restaurant that one time they served this food. <laughs> now, blazing fast. Now, I will say this. <laughs> But Probably somewhere mention. neither one of you have been, and it's not necessarily fast food, but shout out to Wawa. And I think you heard me talk about Wawa before. I have. But I Wawa like is like there. a better version of QT, and it's only on the East Coast. Oh, yeah. you talk about And you could go in there, and they got the computer screen, and you just type in whatever you want. And the ingredients, like on the sandwich, are super fresh. Way yeah. better than Subway, way better than whatever. Where was this at? gas station. On the East Coast only. Oh. Well, they got trees and stuff out there. We don't got trees in Arizona. All right. They probably get their pick their stuff out the. You guys have trees that are all green, oh, like cactuses. <laughs> oh, like where the trunk is green, like the branches are green. Here? Yes, everywhere. I don't know what tree kind of tree that is. Where the trunk is green, everything and the branches is green, are green, and like yeah. Like you might have been high or something. I'm gonna huh? take here in Phoenix. Everywhere they're everywhere. They're like off, like on every street. I mean, in Arcadia, all the trees are painted white at the like the halfway. <laughs> <laughs> so you don't I'm cross so... into them at night. <laughs> I mean, I guess that could be what it is. I was wondering. I was wondering why they did that. <laughs> green. The whole tree is green. A cactus? No. That's why they paint the tree so cars don't crash with it, so you can see them. I'm gonna. That's why they're white. I mean, it's not a new thing. This has been for decades. Yeah, but it's crazy you don't know that. But you go tell me about the Philippines crackdown on Hagar. All right. And, and, like that's a common story: is the trees being painted half. Wait. Okay, but you. De- I mean, <laughs> what, bro? Vice News talks about Duterte or however you say his name. I don't watch that every stuff, day. All right, Vice News. Okay, I'm not talking about watching the program. All I'm talking right. about on Twitter. They literally on every day, every week, whatever. I find it hilarious. You didn't know why the trees were painted Vice white. News is fire. But you corrected oh, me on right. John Wilkes' the death of Abraham Lincoln like that. Like, you might be a moron for saying no. that. And it was the, I it mixed was the it up. Kennedy. I yeah, mixed you- it up. Yeah, yeah. I mixed up the. This, this and then you said 1836. I mixed them up. I did. I've literally been in the theater where he was shot. The man jumped off the balcony. Who's travels? <laughs> I don't travel. I go to the same places. Um, well, fine, we'll talk about the girl thing. This is not... Huh? We'll do the growth thing. Because I do want to talk about fast food stuff. Do oh, you want to do true crime first? I do true crime. Then. It's up to you. Oh, it's, I thought we were doing the grail thing first. Let's Just do true care. crime first. Okay. This He's been begging for it for like, pause for like 20 minutes, so... Well, we, we need to do it all the time. I don't know why we never remember to put it in. Pause. Yes, I've had this from Andy Green for like three weeks. But the why don't you ever say something? Sh- I'm, this show last two weeks ago, whatever, was two hours and 25 minutes or something. ran out of tape. We could have did two hours and 28. <laughs> all right. All right, go. Anna's first true crime. You know how this works? Yes. For the new listeners? We have to guess where it took place. Where it took place. <laughs> This is All right, George so Martin, the boost knob with this, true crime. I'm going to read this headline that's linked inside this story that has nothing to do with this story, but it's pretty funny. Massachusetts man says intruder broke into his home. Massachusetts. And cleaned it. <laughs> Wait, what? This is completely unrelated to the true crime. Break my house. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I'm like, are you busy? <laughs> that's a cleaning service. We'll come to the front door. We come to the chimney. We come to the break in. All right. You ready for the true crime? You ready, Anna? I'm ready. Let's do this. Let's go. Man broke into blank home, and blank is the state. <laughs> <laughs> Man broke into blank home with cat. Arrested wearing homeowner's Christmas onesie. Okay. Ooh. A man accompanied by his cat named Spaghetti made himself, oh my God. I hate made himself like at home after breaking into a blank residence on Sunday. I'm assuming Sunday was a couple weeks ago. Um, trying on a woman's onesie, eating a cupcake, and making coffee. <laughs> it happened at 3.45 p.m. <laughs> what? And this was a recent one or like a one in the past, like around Christmas time? Uh, this is from July 9th. Oh, my God. The homeowners told hey. police they returned home and noticed damage and items that didn't belong to them. They said they found a cat wearing a shirt in the crawl space beneath the house. It's a crawl space. Where do when, they have crawl spaces? Oh, when, officers are, when officers arrived, a man wearing the owner's Christmas onesie emerged from the crawl space. <laughs> Bro. If he got stuck, he'll <laughs> Okay. Is that it? Uh... 
They found the homeowner's Christmas onesie in the dryer. Wait, what? <laughs> I so, skipped some oh stuff God. that I had what already read. What was he wearing read. if he took that off and put it in Yo, the I have dryer? No idea. And Spaghetti was wearing a shirt. The so cat. He was, spaghetti he was, was wearing booked, a shirt. He was booked into jail on first degree burglary, first degree criminal mischief, and third degree theft charges. He Animal control was called to the scene after Spaghetti refused to come out of the cross. <laughs> Police said the homeowner declined her onesie, not be returned after he was arrested. Okay, so maybe he put the man's onesie oh, in the dryer, or we oh, yeah, yeah, well, the woman's one. Yeah, something. One or one, but the other one in the dryer. I think he put on the woman. He wanted it to be warm. I don't know. I don't want to know. I think that's what it said. Um, it's confusing. I okay. We get three state guesses, and I have, a, and I'll give you a hint after the first two. If you don't get it right. That should tell you where it is. You should know. But. I got two guesses. All right. I don't even know. I'm just, that's, a, that's a full story. I'm going Wisconsin. That and was I'm going to be my guess. And I'm, <laughs> I'm going Wisconsin, Washington State, or Oregon. Them the ones I'm going with. So you're you're going for colder weather because they have onesies? I'm going for colder weather. His cat's name Spaghetti. <laughs> Because only only weird like more like country type states they name their cat stuff like that. Yeah, like but the man is obviously crazy. <laughs> I mean, no, but, does it matter? No, he's not but crazy. That made me he's think lonely. <laughs> the name spaghetti made me think of the South, but then the onesie made me think Wisconsin for some reason. It's Wisconsin. It gotta be Wisconsin. It has um, to be. It has to be Wisconsin. And he had a cupcake. Ooh, he's eating a cupcake. They might have a sprinkles out there. Oh. <laughs> right. Cupcake, crawl space, onesie, spaghetti the cat. <laughs> it gotta be Wisconsin. And I would even I would go with I'm going Wisconsin, Oregon, and Washington, but I feel like Wisconsin, Illinois, something else. Indiana. Can we, okay, can we get our guesses now? What's your guesses? You said five states. Like, six. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, the onesie made me think of Wisconsin, so that's my first guess. But then the name Spaghetti made me think of Alabama or something like that. And then I don't know if I have a third guess. We well, use it after our first guess, we get clues. After second guess. After our I second you, guess. So I gave you two guesses. If I give Greg the... the, the well, you didn't say the second one. I said Alabama. Alabama. All right. You're going to know the answer, so don't say anything. You may know the answer. This happened in Multnomah County. Oh. Oh! You, then don't didn't you me. guess... <laughs> you guessed <laughs> Oregon, right? I did guess Oregon. That was one of them. There. Correct. I knew it. 15 miles from Portland. Nobody in Gresham, Arizona, Oregon. Nobody in a majority hot state names their cat spaghetti and stuff like that. You go to Oregon and stuff. The <laughs> cat, what does that got to do with I anything? lived in Oregon. My friend, his hamster name was stupid. <laughs> Fact. <laughs> and we sure, that's fine, food. but I don't know how that. <laughs> I never would have made it Oregon. That. That oh, no you got to think stuff like that. <laughs> like they name their like stuff that like they really love out there. Like somebody, he just really loves spaghetti. In, in hot states and down in hot states you try to name your, like animal stuff cool like cool names and stuff you no know, actually hot states people name their animals with human names like Brian and like Dave and stuff like that that's a no. fact yeah you coming up with some weird reasons huh? alright I was right the though the crawl space thing was the one that you got it right based on not the cat's name uh, it was the cat's name that was my hit alright she brought the clue up well, the onesies had to be cold. She that's recognized the crawl space, yeah. yes, but that's... What are you talking about? I had already had them stays in mind once you said onesie. Right? <laughs> I wanted... I thought Bro, Illinois or somewhere. You, Dang, I'm the champ. Yes, you've gotten two right ever. The you first right. one and that one. <laughs> All right. Let's, two men was a dead giveaway. Uh, shout out to uh, International O. Uh, he has a blog called uh, The Sneaker Tribune. And he asked George and I to write a little something, send a picture, and write a little something about our grill. So shout out to him. Go to the website. I thought it was Miss Grail. Uh, it was Miss Grail, but I don't have that. And that made me think of the question. Yeah, you got two pairs Do of we black still cars? have grills? <laughs> like, I don't have a grill anymore. No wonder when I picked Black Cause on the show two years ago, you, Elijah, you got angry. Huh? <laughs> no, okay. I, I said Black Cause are better than like, Grays. Mm. Yeah, I did too. Oh. Well, we all did, I think, at the time. Okay. But you didn't get Grays and neither did I. You're right. 
Now, if that's Unless the other that's secret, your other secret. <laughs> no, I'm not joking. <laughs> actually, <laughs> I don't know. Secret, no, I'm joking. Huh? Oh, you do know. you still have that's a grill? Supposedly. Do actually you know, let's go to Anna first. Do you have a grill? No, I don't. I don't think that. I don't know. I don't look at it like that. Like I don't look at. I, they're just. I'm like they're just shoes. So if you like them, then you get them. You don't have don't nothing like, that you're like like dying to get or super well, like, want. Uh, like bread ones would be a grail, right? You don't have those. I don't have a pair. Do you still want? But a wouldn't pair? they? Yes, but wouldn't that be a grail? I guess to you, I don't, I don't know. know. Like, I don't really, I don't know. They're just shoes. I text George, like it, like and it. George said, obviously his was... um. No, no, no. That was when it was one that you didn't get. Oh. The story said the time you right. didn't get the grail. Okay. So mine's obvious. It's Elephant Air Max 1. Why is that obvious? I, th- I honestly thought you would have said NMD. What shoe do you know that NMD I don't nice have kicks. that... All oh, right, no. Oh, I don't know. What shoe do you... That's the only shoe I talk about all the time when you talk about shoes I don't have. Yeah, I know, but I didn't know you considered like the one that got away. <laughs> all right, what other shoe would be the? Yes, all right, we talking about like like you mean left at the altar? Well, define the shoe left me at the store. Define Grail. Like... I don't know anymore because I don't have one anymore. My only Grail was Jordan Six with the Nike swoosh in the back. That was mine. So then pick a shoe that you don't have. Probably phone posit. Uh, what you call it? I thought about that. But I think you my, literally drew a picture and came and brought it down and gave it to me in my office. I think <laughs> we're copping these. I think, bro, we just camped out for five days. We're not copying. But at that moment when I drew yeah, them, you we right. Didn't know. We didn't know that, but it doesn't matter. But I think my grill is something that I had and I got rid of. I think my grill is Katie Weatherman's. Right. I think it is. Why not? Your grill can be whatever you want, I, but I'm still gonna make fun of you for saying that. Like, yeah. what are you talking How about? How much your elephants in your price, in your size? Like around what? I'm close to a thousand now. Oh, is that high? Dang, that was like yeah, six hundred. What? So they can? Are they still grails then? Like, I, I feel like once you get to a thousand range, they're like, oh no, they're unobtainable. It's gonna come out again at some point, I would imagine. Oh, I might have to wait right. ten years, but see, I feel like. That's why I don't have a grill anymore because everything that's come out, we've gotten it all. Okay, Katie Weatherman's are never coming out again. We know that, so I don't want to. Wait, um, why do you think that? <laughs> what made you just why do that? Why Katie Weatherman's come out? I mean, the same reason why other stuff retro is not, re- not going to come out like Air Max soon. One Elephant is a different stratosphere than right, Katie Weatherman. We're not saying which that? one should come out over the other. All right. But it, it could come out in about 15 it years. All right. Look. They would bring I, out like nerfs and stuff before that. No, they wouldn't. Yes, they would. No, they wouldn't. Not they wouldn't in the bring same out nerf box again. But yes, they would. They would bring. That's the most popular KD four mm, by price. No, yes, no, no, it no. is. It's not the most popular. It's the most sought after. It's not the okay, most well, popular. More than when did elephants reason. come out? Originally, two thousand last year. Seven, no, 18. originally. No, the last one. Oh, the last one. Six, 2000, I think. Two thousand six. Sixteen. Yeah, last 18. year. Eighteen. Oh, okay. Last year. Was it last year? It was either last year or 17. Oh. No, it was last year. I don't think I have a grill anymore. And I feel like you can't say stuff like Yeezy 2s and stuff. They're like $4,000. Like, that's unobtainable now. It's obtainable if you're a certain level of... 17. A certain tax bracket, I guess. <laughs> I don't think them joints even got... Dr- did anyone draft them in our draft? Of course we did. I can't the stop elephants? it. I just watched it the other day. No, none of us $1, drafted $1, those. No, no, no. He's talking about when we did a draft another year. Of course you did. $1, Somebody drafted those. $1,000. Wait, That's impossible. they came out in 2017? Is that what you said? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's what it says. I thought Atmos you just Elephant, said 18. 2017. Oh, wait. I don't know. Because we did the draft last year. Oh, wait. No, we didn't do one last year. We didn't do a draft last year. Yes, we did. Yeah, you of did. Of 2017 shoes. The draft we just did, did was of 2018 Oh, okay. Shoes. Yeah. Bro. Okay, and the and the amount we had was seventy five hundred, which is why you went down. But I said that when we drafted, I said the and during the draft, I said the uh, resale on the shoes of twenty seventeen yeah, was way higher, crazy compared to. Yeah, simple drafted the like first three shoes he drafted were off whites or something, and they were all two thousand dollars <laughs> or whatever. Yes, it was the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my well, entire life. The first life. year, like either simple or I drafted Gucci's. Like <laughs> that's, what, no, that's how his draft that year was the dumbest thing in history. He drafted forty thousand dollar what you call it. What? Uh, autom- automated shoes. Like what the- are them joints called? Oh, mag joints? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, 
Look, she knows. She knows I don't everything. know. Shout out to International, like I said. Though. That was the very first I'm gonna episode send something to I listened to, and I was like, what is this? I'm going to send something. I don't know if George will send something, but I am gonna. I might write it up for George and just <laughs> Yeah, you're going to have to because I'm, you know, make I'm it not up. doing it. I'm going to make up something I'm gonna crazy. Make it up, yes. I'm going to be like, families outside in the rain. We took our shirts off and stuff. It was crazy. Can I just say, though, I don't know why elephants are so expensive. Like, what? <laughs> Oh yeah, I don't either. These, I don't get the why Jordan either. ones are almost a better buy than the uh, than. How much are the Jordan ones? Is it the pack or just the shoe? It's just the shoe, but I've seen the pack for the same price as, and then you, know, you could probably turn around and sell the other one for five hundred. I would think. Mm-hmm. People, y'all swear that that Jordan and that cement elephant pack sucks. Oh, it sucks. I don't think it's that bad. Oh, it sucks. It sucks, but it's not that bad. It sucks, but it doesn't suck. It sucks, but you can make five hundred dollars off of it. <laughs> uh, like I it said, definitely sucks. Shout out the Sneaker Tribune. I mean, like I said, I don't know if I have a grill. Like I just, I, I've bought everything we've owned. Like we own, All right, own man. or have owned I'm, everything. I'm done with you, man. What the only thing you highest can really bid think on of. a size twelve for the Jordan Three alone is six hundred. I knew I should have bought that oh, pack crap. when it was like nine fifty, and then I would have ended up with that shoe. Even though it's a little bit different, I would have ended up with that shoe for like three hundred bucks. If you couldn't pick. Oh my Here. God. I'm there. so angry right now. You hear that buzzing sound, Hello? right? A little bit. Headphones on, so. Oh, I think that's George's phone next to the thing. No, it's not. Oh, maybe it's move not your cord? Good. Let me see. Yeah, it's your cord. All right. I'll oh, there again. it is. It now is. it's buzzing. Um, if you couldn't pick elephants, what would the next? What would, what would it be then? I don't have really another shoe I'm, that... I think once you get to a certain age, you're out of green. <clears throat> you do. We've copped everything. No, I own both the shoes currently still that are my favorite two shoes of all time. That's why it wouldn't be those. Which one is that? Jordan 4 and Jordan 1? Oh, Jordan 4, Jordan 4, Black Cement, White Cement. I mean, those are, I told oh, you. Oh, all right. Yeah. So, I don't know. Girls and I one. still have a black and red uh, one from the I don't have DMP White Cement, I want White Cement. Is, CDP so, they have fours? Mm-hmm. I do, too. I want to get, I want to get. Oh, and I do have those. Oh, I'm selling those. Oh, did I sell those? Oh, what? Bro, white Cement 4. Who are you talking to? Yourself? White Cement 4s. <laughs> no, she said she wants to get White Cement 4s. I want I'm White like, Cement 4s. I said I do, too, but I'm like, I think I have those when I sold those. I don't, I don't know. think you never went to get them. Maybe I didn't. I have elephants. Oh, she got <laughs> elephants. Yeah, I know, well, yeah, I knew that. I've seen you wear them before. You brought them here? IG. Nope. Oh, dang. I barely brought any shoes. I don't know. I, I don't mean, know. yeah, you, whatever. I hate you for that, but that's fine. <laughs> George hates everybody. Asians get everything. Uh, is there anything else to talk about? <laughs> that's actually true, though, because. <laughs> what? Actually, I'm not going to say it's true, but no I will Lee, say we have, we have a really pretty decent like asian following that i talk to on a regular basis like i'm talking about stuff that like i like regular stuff they have nothing but absolute fire stuff i'm like i, I think from what i've noticed they didn't start buying as early as we did so like all these uh-huh. sbs and stuff that i'm stuck with they didn't buy <laughs> no any of that those, right. yeah. uh, so yeah, like right. some of them cats who only have 25 shoes they just oh uh, yeah, yeah you're right you're right because so you can get constantly get fire if you sell fire yeah because a lot of these cats some of them only got like 18 yeezys yeah. and like three air force air max ones and like a jordan one or something you're right i'm tripping yeah. <clears throat> i'm wilding uh anything else <laughs> asians are the best still though at in what? what? Yeah, I was like, in what? <laughs> what are we Look at about? that. This is an equality podcast. Relax. <laughs> like, uh, in karate? I mean, like, I don't really I think don't a lot know. of Are they the karate, best at karate? Though. I don't think so, though, because I told you when I got in a fight with Melvin and I kicked him in his stomach, all the Filipinos that were losing their minds. I was like, he has to be Filipino, okay, Melvin. If you no, no, walking no, out around black, somewhere, black, oh, some of the Filipinos. Okay, oh, there's a lot of Filipinos. If you walking out around somewhere and you see someone like this, and You've like never Mexican, seen that. Okay, stop. If it's like a Mexican dude, you're not going to be scared of him. But if it's a Japanese dude, yeah, you turn around. Really? No, that's not true. Trust me. No, he'd have to be wearing a suit like Chun Li. I mean, like like Jackie, like, like Jet Li. <laughs> like Jet Li. Then I'd be nervous. But if it's just a regular Asian guy that does that, doesn't mean nothing. That's racist. Huh? We're not talking about Jay here. <laughs> We're talking about like All someone right. who actually can scrap and it looks tough. Okay. <laughs> look tough. Jet Li doesn't look tough. I mean, like. Jackie Chan doesn't look tough. But he'd mop us. All right. I think. I don't know. Oh, he would mop you. Okay, I'm just checking. Well, now, for wild, a second. Wow, mop you. For a second. Now, Jack, Jackie Chan, he can be corny. All right. Yes. What I got to do with this? Just going back. <laughs> just going back Recycling to the corny. topics. What the, Are we going to do top 10 fast foods now? Okay. Are you guys ready to do I'm that? I'm sure ready? I said many racist things in the last five minutes. You really have. And no. Jay is going to be super offended. Guess what? I don't care. We're <laughs> never going to get We're never going to get paid. <laughs> They're going to be like, they're going to start docking us. <laughs> All right. 
top 10 fast food joints, whatever, restaurants to us. And for the record, a building that has a Taco Bell and Pizza Hut together doesn't count as one. <laughs> They're split, so don't even try no tricky stuff, all right? All right, and we already know everyone's going to hate. This list is impossible to make because... Yeah, no, it's not. Yes, it is. Why? What do you mean? It's based on it's, preference. It's easy. It's it, was, it was... Location, too. Uh, right. Settle down, you. We don't got Zaxby's. I, a, uh, I understand that, but oh. I've been to one of the places on my list only one time, and it's not here, and it's on my list. You've now been it's, one time? Now it's down near the bottom. Yes, okay. because I, okay. can, I still can compare it to the other p versions uh, that are like it here. Do you guys have any honorable mentions? Yes. I don't. Wawa was the only thing I just wanted oh, to mention. Oh, I have a mention. ton. Wawa's a gas station. No, but you get food inside, like hot food and sandwiches and stuff. That could be fast food. That's a Yo, what's up with this? That's a convenient. That's a convenience store. No, it's the same thing as going into Chipotle. So do you kiss? Oh, they make it in front of you, like in yes. a thing. Oh, okay, okay. I thought it was what like you, you. No, because QT, you type in the computer and then they just bring it out the back. I didn't know it was like a. Oh no, they make it in. The, well, I don't know if, if pizza or a burger works the same way. I don't know if they have a grill, but you make a sandwich. The ingredients okay. are like something. I, they're I, all right there. I thought you type it and then like you wait to the side and somebody comes out the back like here's your sandwich. We made it in the back. That's a little different thing. Bro, that could come from a different restaurant. Though, <laughs> No, no, I have no idea. That would be tight, dude. That's a business model. All right. That's why Jerry's running a business. Um, yes. All right. What's your mention? It was I not have cracking so many. So I almost have. have so many. Look at all my honors. Oh my god. What do you got? <laughs> all right. Uh, you guys don't. I don't think you guys have Waba Grill. Nope. Waba Grill. It's yeah, like. We uh, no, we don't. Yes, we do. There's also like Waba Grill. Waba. No, we don't. W a b a Grill. Yes, yeah. those are here. Do you guys have them here? Them. Yes. Those are uh, good. I prefer them to plain broiler. I don't know if you guys have that either. Uh, is, Subway yeah. is on there. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh, you guys have one. What is wrong? Oh, you know what? I've seen it before. Subway's honorable mention. Uh, Del Taco. Subway is trash. Oh, I had a I mean, it will, don't stop me from eating that. That's it why. It, <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's a thing, though. I always I end up there sometimes, and I'm like, why am I even here? But So it has been my honorable mention. I'm just saying. Jolly Bee, because it's a Filipino joint. And, I, uh, there's a lot of people that eat Jolly Bee like on on. It's big on YouTube. Like all them cats is. that do like those YouTube eating shows or whatever. They always eat yeah. Jolly Bee. Jolly Bee. Uh, I like Poke Bowl places, but there's not like a place that I could would. I say. hate Pokies out here. I guess there's, that's a change. There's right? Poke Bowl places everywhere. Yeah, they're they're everywhere. everywhere. Uh, it's because it's nouveau. And I don't think you guys have Farmer Boys here. That's like a California thing. Southern California, maybe. I don't know. Farmer Boys. No, yeah, that's only in California. See, that's why the lists are going to be because like. Well, that's why I put them in the honorable mentions. The point is, people are going to complain. Like, if no, if none of us say Whataburger, if we have any fans that live in Texas, they're going to be yeah. Whataburger should be number one. Whataburger is trust rash. It's not okay. The breakfast is not. I would never go there for breakfast. The burgers are not trash, but that's but no one should ever be like, what a burger's better than In N Out. Bro, have you ever been to a Whataburger and seen a line ever? Never. Whataburger In N Out has a line at every In N Out. Right. Now, Whataburger Speaks isn't better than McDonald's either. It's not better than anything. I, uh, you can make an argument that Whataburger's burger is better than McDonald's burger. Like Mc the actual meat they use. <laughs> <laughs> you can make that argument. <laughs> Yeah, but I mean, I'm not saying. But, like, what do you mean? You act like that's blasphemy or something. Huh? This is funny. Like, you broke down the burger like that. <laughs> now, their burger meat is better. <laughs> I'm just saying. This no, is but it's true. About. Like, in and out has. I would think Wendy's had better than both of them. Burger meat. I'm fine with that argument. Wendy's I don't know if it's true, it's but I'm fine with it. it. Yeah, I don't like the square. I don't thing. like the square thing. But it did make my list. Right, I remember, I literally remember being on an airplane when I was a kid and some man asking me about Wendy's. Like, he said something. I was like, oh, yeah, Wendy's. He was like, is that the place with the square patties? Well, where <laughs> I don't is he from? know why I remember that. I'm pretty sure I was flying in New York. See, anybody, but it was in California. I have no idea. Anybody who hates this list is because they're going to be like, bro, you guys got to try Bojangles. And I'm like, yo, fam, that's in like... What, Chicago or somewhere? Florida? No, south and east coast. Something, yeah. Like, it's like, I don't got that. Like, so these, this is going to be... That person would be correct, by the way. Maybe? I don't that. know. I don't know, trust me. What's Bojangles? What does it sell? Like, it's southern like food? Like, Pop, KFC, Popeyes. Oh, like see, I haven't had fried chicken from a fast food joint in probably four years. So, 40? Four. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, huh? All right, who wants to go Wait, first? Wait, I'm not done. I have oh, a million. Oh, my God. Go. Okay. Um, it, also in Southern California, there's Senior Baja. Sometimes it's called El Taco Nazo. Love that place. Uh, the, I said Farmer Boys. Oh, and Willie's Chicken Shack in uh, New Orleans. Love that place. That place, I've heard about that place. I've never been there, but that place is supposed to be fire. 
better. Better than Popeyes. Yeah. Fire. But I put it on honorable mention. Popeyes I, has been whack for a while now. Though. Their their prices have gotten better. All right. All right. You got honorable mention, George? I don't have any. No, nah, I just wanted to mention Wawa, even though it's really not. Doesn't I mean I I I'll, you go throw out a list like I could have put like fifty fast food places on a list. Uh, look at me. I'm, yeah. I eat, okay. I, but you go. But you travel. I'm not more. a vegan. Like you, <laughs> yeah, but you travel more than like I I haven't been to New Orleans and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, but so I like, didn't put on like somebody in the comments on something was like, have you ever been to Swenson's? It's like a Midwest the heck burger is place. That? Oh. Supposed to be f- super fire burger. I've never been there, so I can't put it on there. Even though I t- just because I travel somewhere, the only one I can confirm for you is absolute trash. Now the actual hot I dog. Say, oh, now okay. the actual hot dog itself was good, but the chili. Oh my god! What is was the place? Absolute trash. The okay, one in Cincinnati. Oh, I forgot. I it. forgot the name. I forgot. Um, I Skyline know. Chili. Oh, that's the right. chili is absolute bro they put cinnamon in their chili you put Who cinnamon, put my chili? cinnamon in the chili fighting. and i don't mean like a spicy like cinnamon stick or like you choose cinnamon gum obviously you don't think like sweet you think like you know spice hot whatever it's not that kind of cinnamon it's like the cinnamon they do the cinnamon challenge from all right that's, that's trash yeah. and it's shredded beef in the chili not ground beef i've never that's had so that weird it's weird but like you could make it work your ingredients have to be if just you, right if with you, that, though. Yeah, if you do everything else right. Because if you put shredded beef and chili, you're almost making just like a, a slider, like a, a yeah, pile of meat. Like a like pork. Yeah. Sloppy Joe, but it's worse. Um, who wants to go first? I'll go first. Okay. Number 10, I got Jack in a Box. Now, I haven't been to Jack in a Box in a while, but Jack in a Box tacos still reign supreme to me. Jack in the Box is fire, but I love it's Jack not in the, the top 10 for me. I love Jack in the Box. Number nine, I just got Sandwich Spot. Jimmy John, Subway, anything like. Now, my favorite sandwich place of all time was Quiznos. I loved Quiznos. I did too. So why didn't you put Quiznos in? I have I it down here, but they don't exist there. anymore. Yeah, there's no more yeah, Quiznos. No, there's not, not in Arizona. So I mean, there might not be one in this. Quiznos is still in business. Trust me. Where? I thought they all went out. There's one in there... your neighborhood. No. Matter of fact, yes, there is. No, no there's, there's no more not. Quiznos, man. I haven't been to Quiznos in years. Yeah, the last one, that's it. There's a Quiznos. I think there might have been one in Chino Hills. like 4001 East Broadway Road. What state is this? In Phoenix. Impossible. I would make the journey. Um, That's out of, that gotta be out of Broadway and 40th Street. Call it. It says it's closed right now, but it's, I mean, yeah, that's out of business. It's only 750. (laughs) It's closed. Stop. Number eight. Bro, I got Quiznos. The website still works. Like, what are you talking about? Number eight. You, Friday yeah, lunch. you can only order online. You can't go to a restaurant. <laughs> yes, order Quiznos <laughs> online. Number eight. It's a business part. You're number eight. At 6 p.m. No, what do you want from me? I got anything with Bertos on the end. Filibertos. That's a good one. Any Bertos. Okay. I didn't put any on my list, but I should have. Like, they all. Especially Just because like, it's hard to explain night? to people who don't live in yeah. Arizona. Like, No, we have Albertos. Yeah, but yeah. I, I it's like Filibertos. Right. I grew up in California in LA, and there's I didn't know what Bertos was till I went to Tucson and Nico's. Fire. What's Nico's? Just another one of the O's. Oh, really? Nico's <laughs> is in Tucson, only in Tucson is fire. Number seven, I got Panda Express. Now every time I eat it, I'm like, oh dear God! But Panda Express is still good. It's you trash, but it's good. For what's on your list? Number six, I got Chick Fil A. I got Chick Fil A at number six because Chick Fil A is freaking expensive. One, two, I've never been full when I finish it. Like you have to order <laughs> the largest nuggets and two chicken sandwich and two fries to feel full at Chick Fil A. That's a one percent fat. Okay. You do. That's my that's my bottom six. My bottom five. Okay. <laughs> what you got? All right, I picked for number ten Carl's Jr. Because they make this. I think it's called the Southwestern Chicken Sandwich, and it's like my favorite. One of my favorite things ever from any fast food place. That's the only reason why I got number 10. I'm not mad at Carl's Jr., but man, there's a Quiznos in San Bernardino. Okay, I'm driving to San Bernardino. <laughs> but, <laughs> but, but Carl's Jr. is be so dirty inside. Maybe here. To Ours me. are not dirty. Uh, Jersey Mike's. Right there. I picked Jersey Mike's Filthy. for number nine. Jersey Mike's is over I can't tell you if I've ever eaten there, to be completely honest. No. It's good, but like, I don't like my subs toasted too much. Huh? I don't like my the bread. The bread crunching. is hard. It's like it's eat, better than Subway. It's like eating Wait, bread is Jersey sticks. Mike's the one where you go and they slice the meat and put it on there while you stand yeah. on there? Yeah. Okay, maybe. Like I by uh, by work. Yeah, that's the one that's at Phoenix Convention Center or whatever. No, no, no. That's not a Convention Center, but you don't. That's Jimmy John's, about. right next to Chipotle, right across from NYPD where we eat. Jimmy, Mike, Jersey yeah, Mike's. Yeah, we've never across. been there. 
I thought we went to there. something with Alicia one time when she was leaving or whatever. Didn't that we went to Jimmy Mike's then? Oh yeah, no, that yeah, was five we guys. Drive. We went to five guys. Me, oh, was Jimmy? Five guys. We went to a place where they were slicing meats. <laughs> the butcher. <laughs> so we went to the butcher. Yes. I, I think Jersey Mike's is better than um, Jimmy John's. Yeah, Jimmy John's is weak. I eat it, but it's weak. Uh, That's then, one million percent facts. I eat it, but it's trash. <laughs> only because they deliver to our building. Like I almost would rather go to Subway because it's That's cheaper the than Jimmy only John's. Only reason why. Uh, then I picked Popeyes for Pop- number seven. Popeyes is delicious, but I'm angry at Popeyes right now. It used to be tradition to eat there every Saturday when we were in college and stuff, but like after a while, it got wild. Popeyes is fire. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, right, no, I'm that was number eight. Ten, nine, eight. Oh, number eight. I'll Popeyes. explain that story one day. I'm, I'm jaded. <laughs> What else you got? Uh, so number <laughs> seven. I think this is fast food, right? The Habit. Yeah, that counts. yeah I like off. I like the Habit. I like those burgers. That counts. It's it's off. You're not on. Oh, I'm on fire. Okay. I'm about to. And then I'm us. trying to get it to where this will like stay under here. I'm about to send on. a scathing email right. to these. Is it guys? working out? Yeah. yeah. Right. Number six, Yoshinoya. Yoshinoya is fire. Mm. What's that? Mm. Might not, like Yoshi like, Bowlism. You might, you might not know what it is. Yes. Japanese food, uh, or Chinese food, or whatever. Yes, well. Beef bowl. I guess it's Japanese because the name it is. is it's Japanese. beef bowl. It's delicious. That's the bottom. <laughs> Make it sound That's gross. It. Beef bowl just sound crazy. Pull it's delicious. What you got, George? Number ten. I got a bunch of stuff that you guys haven't even said yet, so I'm actually uh, I'm okay. glad because okay. it's, it might now, be on top. Now my list is burger heavy. I'm just gonna tell you that now. I think when I was making it, I was like. I don't have no none of this, none of that. Burger heavy. Oh, mine's, okay. mine's number, not at all. Yeah. Number 10, Culver's. I don't know if you guys have ever gotten a burger from Culver's. I don't even know what that is. Culver's it's, burgers burger. are good. Their burgers are good, but when I actually eat it, I'm worried how unhealthy it is. Like, <laughs> That's I'm like, a good thing. Like, I go like you this. You don't eat like, it every day. Like, it's Nothing but butter. Like, yeah, you're right. That's why it's good. It's good, but yo. They're out and here? the ice cream. Yeah, yeah it's out here. Okay, There's one right by where you're staying. There's one at Camelback and like 12th Street or Let's something. Let's just too. tell everybody where I'm staying. Okay. Well, you're not staying at Camelback and 12th Street. Well, if you, no, stop so. chasing, <laughs> you stop chasing Odessa around town. You <laughs> She's going to hear that and be like, well, let's She's hurry. not listening. Uh, number nine, <laughs> something you mentioned earlier, not on your list, but when you were bringing it up, Bojangles is absolute fire no and is better than any of the chicken places with the exception of chick-fil-a and i look at it a little bit differently because chick-fil-a technically started as like a chicken sandwich place and then they started making nuggets and whatever else whereas like kfc and all these other places started as like you know a bucket of chicken family (laughs) style or whatever so bojangles is much more like churches kfc popeyes than um (laughs) chick-fil-a but chicken sounds funny (laughs) We went to South Carolina, and my stepdad was like, "We gotta go to Bojangles." And I was like, "Bro, so it's only the east and south." From what I understand, it's just east and I I mean, yeah, east and south. From what I understand, that name just sounds like some old Dixie Rock. Hate it. Yeah, you right because that Bojangles was like uh, yeah, black black face. I don't like it. Like Uh, marionette or something, right? They should change it. Well, I'm sure it's owned by white folks, despite the fact that they make a lot of foods that blacks like. I mean, let's just be honest here. I don't SMH. think it's... I don't think I go there then. <laughs> so I don't eat fried chicken I and mean, stuff in front of white people anyway. So. If all these businesses that are super old were probably when black people couldn't own these businesses, yeah, so like, like the Social Security <laughs> office, <laughs> we, we should probably be honest about a lot honestly, of this the stuff. Government like, building everything. Just putting people money in white people's pockets. Like I'm not. I'm not under any impression. I'm like when I buy Nikes, I'm not making black people rich. Oh, of course I not. Mean, uh, there are some people, yeah, but I mean, like, I'm not under some. Like, if you rich. buy Kaepernick's collection, by all means, buy it because it pays him. But we're not making like anybody else who. I buy Jordans. We make Jordan rich. Yeah, but Jordan's white. I mean, he all right, he ain't white, but he's like okay, he's not OJ Simpson, but he's like. Guess that's it. No <laughs> jump, no jump man deal. He's not exactly like. Bro, he's literally said like he hates rap music and he hates like that's old Jordan. He has Travis Scott on the roster now. He can't hate Did rap you music. See his pants when he met with Travis Scott. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is old. What else you got? Anyways, number eight. This is a L.A. special. You guys will definitely know about this. Fat Burger. Fat Burger. Oh dang, that's a good one. Insanely delicious. No, that's a good I don't one. like it. Oh, you're crazy. I got shot at a Fat Burger. That was the first time I got shot at. 
<laughs> you specifically <laughs> pride in They yourself. missed. Oh, well, yeah. Mm. You specifically pride in No, it wasn't yourself. for me, but I was with the people that was getting shot at. Yeah, exactly. Uh, that's why I don't sit at no restaurants on my back <laughs> turned to nothing, dude. That's a the fact. One that, the one that I probably should have put that on here Oakland. that I didn't, that deserves respect. Actually, you know what? Let me go back and do an honorable mention. If you're from L.A., Tommy's. Original chili burger. If you don't know what Tommy's is... Throw yourself off of don't know the what that is. next bridge that Pinkies? close to you. Tommy's. Pinkies is good too. Pinkies is Bob's Big Boy. Tommy's puts chili know. in there. Easy. In their burgers and yeah. stuff. It's chili good. burger. Original yeah. chili burger. Tommy's is fire. I don't think it would make my top 10, but you could slide it somewhere in there. Pause. Number seven, Smash Burger. I don't know how you feel about Smash Burger, but good. their patties are the way, the way they cook it, super good. good. I used to love it, but then last time we went, it's just been downhill. I think like they could do their fries better, but the chicken sandwiches are good. The hot dogs are good. Hot dogs are good. Because Nora dog. I don't know about any other stuff. So Nora dog is good. You do have a lot of burger spots. Yes. And then number six, and the the reason basically is just because how often Hannah and I go there, and the food is good. Like I don't think anybody would just like argue for it or like stand hard for it. Chipotle. Oh yeah, of course. Chipotle number six. That's kind of low. Mm, I didn't Based on the t- amount of times Hannah and I go there, it probably, probably is low. Not. But if you offered these other things to me, I would take it first before Chipotle. I like, don't even have that. But like I said, you don't have Chipotle. There's a lot of st- bro. I looked at that list of American fast food or like quick food places. It was like 500 or 250 restaurants. Like making 10 out of that is impossible. I feel like mine is whack now. Like number five, I got Wendy's. Like I think Wendy's is good. I like it. Burger Square is a little weird, but I like Wendy's a lot. You I think you, you didn't go too far outside the box. I Let's didn't. Uh, but like, I don't. But see, that's why like well, Wendy's my friends, is higher than the other one. Yeah, but see, like people that I know when they go get fast food stuff, I'd be like, dang, why didn't I think it? I never think to go to Kane's, even though it's like down the street. I like, like ooh, I never I think of stuff. Ooh, like Kane's that. is good, but Kane's you good. Bojangles. I forgot. You put that on. Bro, here. Bojangles would go and dookie all over top of Kane's like this. But though, I would never <laughs> think go to go to Bojangles. Popeyes is right by. I would never think to go to Popeyes and get something to eat. Why? Never. I don't know. I don't think. I think the the, the basics. Number four, I got Taco Bell. <laughs> yeah. What are you talking about? But I love Taco Bell. How do you feel after you? Uh, Taco eat Bell is good. Oh. Now after I eat it, I do feel weird. But Taco Bell, you literally go to the window and be like, yo, let me get uh, two cheese gordita crunches. Let me get three hard tacos. Let me get one of them slushes. Let me get a cinnamon twist. That'd be $4. <laughs> like, Not anymore. I prefer Del Taco, I think. Del Taco is, is everything Del Taco, Taco for Bell people who like, want to be anti-Taco Bell. Uh, no, they have different menu items. I hate Del, Del Taco. No, I'm lying. I'll, I'll eat it. But <laughs> like, Del Taco, when was the last time you went to a Wendy's? Del Taco's hamburger a might be the ever. most underrated hamburger in the galaxy. Who? Del Taco's Del Taco makes hamburger <laughs> might be the most underrated burger in We should have did top 10 burger list. I, know. Uh, I didn't even know Del Taco sold a burger. They do. Yes. Fire. Now, the bacon they use, a little bit underwhelming, all right? Burger King sells tacos. Um, <laughs> it's just basically a knockoff Jack in the Box yeah. taco. Number Honestly. three, it is. Number three, in and out Oh, you wild. I got in and out number three, one, because, like, you wild. they don't change up nothing. It's good. Point. Point. I no. would be mad if they changed no, up something. No, no, no. I don't mean get rid of anything, but like, yo, you want to add a chicken sandwich maybe or something? No. Like, you wild why not? They can you add something to it. Yo, you want to throw some chili on these fries or maybe? No. Now, this is another thing too. I hated In-N-Out fries for a long time. I like them now. But when you go to In-N-Out, they give you the most little pieces of fry. They give you these little. All right, so let you, me. You, you gotta pour the fries. So let me. So let me chop the fries. So let me. Gotta pour the fries. Let me help everyone out there who's not from California or Arizona, Vegas, whatever. Uh, In-N-Out expert. Let me help all the people. If you eat in at In-N-Out, you get the fries light, well, or well. If you take them to go. You get the fries regular because by the time you get home, they're going to be a little bit harder. One hundred percent serious. You think I'm joking? I don't I'm get like one that. George is an expert. Million. In and out, per- okay, now if you like, no, but some order. people get it with cheese. Some people <coughs> no, get it. I understand that. If you style. if you like an animal what? style, then then the whole like light well or whatever probably doesn't matter because all you're tasting is cheese and onions and sauce anyways. But if you just I see people complaining all the time about how good In and Out's burgers are, but the fries are bad. Bruh, if you go there to eat, just get it light well. It'll taste ex- and put a little salt on it. Well, It'll it's taste too exactly much. the same. That's why I said light I well. Relax, good. you. <laughs> and put a little bit of salt on it. It'll taste exactly the same as it does anywhere else. I mean, 
obvious can we agree that probably for a basic french fry not counting seasoned fries or whatever mcdonald's probably got the best fries facts now thank you I now, was they, like, got, now they got crazy wild chemicals in them right but but we but can they're still the best okay. i don't yes. care i'll eat a I'll, chocolate i'll eat them i was like please don't let george so, say nobody doesn't have better fries than, than mcdonald's okay so, so no limp, matter what you do an in and out fry is not going to be a mcdonald's fry no but is it going to be the same as a wendy's fry or um wendy's fries burgers really king though. or whatever they're all the same at that point after McDonald's fries. Yes. I don't know what it is about McDonald's fries. Them joints yeah, could be just like the bent. sodas at McDonald's. I like the Chick Fil A waffle fries. I like those them. are really yeah. good, but they but they they they're so big they only give you like four in a box. You got to order like <laughs> five of them. Oh yeah, you're hungry, bro. Either. You spend easily with me and my family go to Chick Fil A. It's easily almost about fifty five dollars. Uh, like that's a fact. It's eight oh four. Who's up? All right. All right. Is it me? I don't. Oh know. Uh, yeah. Uh, number three, In and Out. Number two, McDonald's. It probably should have been higher, yeah, but number two, me. number one, I got Chipotle because I probably eat Chipotle twice. In a and week, Out being one below week. McDonald's is nuts. oh no 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 no! I didn't say now like, McDonald's breakfast best breakfast. Of but McDonald's eat. food is you can look McDonald's food is obviously no some weird of stuff is in. trash, but McDonald's food is forever history and good. Like I don't ever see myself in life. I avoid McDonald's. Yeah, because no it's one eats McDonald's and looks at it like so this is trash. But no one else good. eats McDonald's and a thinks quarter like pounder. Oh my. God, yeah, I mean, it's good. I've it's been not, to McDonald's In-N-Out. twice since I've come here. I can't I could tell you. Else. I couldn't. I could honestly say if I think In and Out is bad, I feel. I don't. I feel less guilty when I eat In and Out. Chipotle <laughs> is number one. That's true. Chipotle is number one because I feel the least guilty when I eat it, and it's, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> now you can only eat Chipotle between the hours of opening one o'clock and then one o'clock and three p.m. And no, sorry, five p.m. You eat Chipotle after your stomach is toast. All right. Facts. No, right. You sound like you right. my turn? enchiladas or whatever. How about like, export? Place, so. Chipotle should sell breakfast. If they replace the rice with egg, bruh. And not lie. replace, just do breakfast. No, replace the egg with the rice with egg and everything else will be the same. Fire. He, he and then needs what that happens, breakfast. Oh, and then what happens at lunch? You bring the rice back out? Bring or? the rice back out. What's the difference? One is egg and one is rice. That's the difference. Why don't you leave having both out all the whole, the whole time? Oh, man. <sighs> You're so young. So. <laughs> I mean, and bad bacon to Go. stuff. And potatoes. Like, All right. Number five. There should be a breakfast place like that, though, like Chipotle. Anyways. She's so mad at me for cutting <laughs> I'm off. not. I'm, I'm trying to let you talk. You got to go wild on the podcast. So that's the whole go thing. Go wild. She uh, goes wild and text messages. <laughs> Most, oh just, and I woke up this morning like, fam, I'm going to throw my trash. <laughs> I stopped looking. I was like, do I can't. My phone buzzed so hard on the thing. Coffee. I was like, yo, what's up with her, bro? I'm gonna go see the check welfare. <laughs> What's number five? El Pollo Loco. I'm down with that. Uh, I always get the five dollar combo good. with the bowl, and the green salsa is the best. That avocado green salsa. Her rice is trash, and you go inside to eat. It's too smoky. <laughs> it's smoky I, I don't. Ear I right hardly now. ever go inside <laughs> to eat. I go through the drive through. Drive through takes forever. Though. Number four, Starbucks. I, I love know. Starbucks. What I don't do care what anyone says. Yeah. And they have good breakfast stuff. Um, Some of their breakfast stuff is all right, but it's, I'm not going there specifically for the food. No. You don't even drink coffee. You're right. Oh, you don't drink so coffee. So you don't go to Starbucks. Well, I love coffee. I love coffee. I went to um, I mean, Einstein Bagels today, though. Einstein's good. Oh, that was so good, but good their choice, coffee Einstein's was bagels. good. It's right next to the Starbucks. Um, number three, Chick-fil-A. Love Chick-fil-A. And... They need to open on Sundays because that's when I always want Chick Fil A is on a Sunday. That's yeah. what everyone says. I mean, In and Out's number two. Nah, you wild. Best cheeseburger. I don't like regular burgers. It has to have cheese in it. So In and Out's yep. number two. And number one is McDonald's because breakfast <laughs> it's just and McDonald's. fries. McDonald's forever. Bro. Oh wait, but In and Out has delicious shakes though. Like, there's nothing at McDonald's that I thought was nasty. Not even on my list. You have a problem. They have the best French fries. How could you leave it out? Wait, wait, wait. They do, which is why I wanted to have the discussion. Okay, was okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Over. Okay, whoa. Well, who has the best burger? Best burger then? Of all? Of all burger places. In and out by far. Not even. No, it's not. You what picked, are you talking? I don't. About? I you. love In and Out. I told you if I did, if I had my finances, my home would be full of In and Out, Sour Patch Kids, and sneakers. Facts. I love In and Out, but In and Out Burger is not the best your burger. Yes, it is. No, it's person. not. Culver's Burger is better than In and Out Burger. You just will mm. die sooner. <laughs> facts. <laughs> That, now I need to try Culver's, facts. but I don't think I can ever uh, say In and Out. Um, in and Out, I feel like I can eat three In and Out burgers and three boxes of fries, and like <laughs> I might, I feel like my cholesterol nothing gets bothered. I feel perfectly no. fine. 
because it's all fresh. You eat one Culver's thing, I'm like, <coughs> no joke, I'm nervous. <laughs> so see a check on me if I'm in the shower I'm too. Crying. Uh, all right. All right, number five. Um, there's going to be a lot of hate on this, but I don't care. Somebody's got to say it. I know what you're going to say. The fries are the best seasoned French fry oh, okay. in the world. I They're not I, the best okay, fry, like regular fry. Say. Rallies, period. The, uh, the food, oh, oh right. I thought you were going to say something He's else. right. The food is fired. Else. The French fries are the greatest fry. I don't know that. Seasoned fry that in the is. entire gallery. Fries are good, though. Number four, this is probably something you guys haven't even had, but if you have not, and I'm a fan of this style of pizza, it, and there's only like two in Arizona, so it's tough. I think there's more in California. Jets. Jets pizza is fire. Detroit style with the um, deep pan and the cheese is like melted to the side to where like the cheese is like the crust instead of the breading. Fire. Mm. I've never Number heard of that. Mm. Fire. I'm going to say Sabaros. <clears throat> okay. okay. No. I will shoot myself. Number three, Chick-fil-A. <laughs> you guys both already said it. You had it three. Shout out to you. How did this not make either one of your lists? Shake Shack. I knew you were going to say that. Shake Shack nope. is Are you kidding so me? Wacky. Talk about expensive, too, for what it is. And talk about a place Bruh. that you, where you can't get full. Shake Shack is expensive and extremely overrated. We were in New York. I was like, yo, we got to try this Shake Shack joint. We were in line forever. Got there. I was like, yo, this joint is nothing. The shakes are decent. Jack in the Box shakes, Sonic shakes, blow them out of the water. Shake Shack is over. It's just nice inside. It's just really nice and cool. That's what it is. It's modern. It's for hipsters. All right. But it's not better than anything. You got that that high and you don't got McDonald's on your list? You disrespect yourself as just a. You a, think a, McDonald's burger tastes better than Shake Shack burger? Everything at McDonald's is freaking good. What are you talking about? There's, I, a, there's no, no, not everything. But yeah, you right. They have a a, a wider list, and their breakfast is fire. Everything, everything is not better. Everything at McDonald's is good. There's nothing you could say at McDonald's that you think is nasty. McRib. There's plenty of things that, that are, doesn't count. There's that's plenty season, of that's, things that's, that's, that's not that's that good. Gross. That's quick strike. There's how, <laughs> how many things have you ever ordered off the menu? You're not ordering the whole menu. You are, Out of you, our entire life of growing up, McDonald's and Happy Meals, and as getting older as men, yes. we've ordered everything off McDonald's. Chicken nuggets, burgers, nuggets. No, fries, no, no, don't say burgers. It. Don't say burgers. Chicken nuggets, Big Macs, quarter pounders, double quarter pounders. <laughs> Those are all burgers. Doesn't matter. Filet fish. <laughs> filet of fishes. I don't know if it's you a fish. You but don't. It's good. When was the last time you ordered filet fish? Probably like six years ago. Exactly. But it was good. Exactly. And it was small enough. I toss it like this. Okay. And bite it. The last time you ordered filet fish was six years ago. You made my point for me. <laughs> but Shake Shack burgers are like this big, Shake and they Shack. cost no, like they're not. ten dollars. You could get a, a Big Shake Mac. Shack. I don't hate Shake Shack, but I hate it. Okay. We know your taste buds are trash. No, it's not. <clears throat> it's, it's expensive. You're absolutely right. I agree 100%. It overrated. It's not disgusting, no, it's not. but it is. It's... And everything's a la carte. No, it's not overrated. They don't even got a combo yeah, meal. Yeah, they The fries need... are good. The burgers are... the. I'm talking about the meat itself. The, if you know how to have good meat, uh, beef no paws and you know how to season it, fire. It's like Shake forgettable. You should be no, I don't even remember what it's the fries taste like. I don't even know what no, they look not. like. Uh, no, it's not. And number one of all time will be number one until I die, hopefully in 100 more years. In and out, you a little hundred by years? far. You're tripping, one that eighty nine. Now I want to get in told and me that out. A lot of times, in, in and out by far. One literally back on the way to your. I place. know. Phenomenal. I should stop my that. favorite by place. Far, but I will I argue with people eat. on Twitter till the end of time about In and Out. Oh, I will too. Like Please any show other... me any fast food place that has a line. I'm not. Th it's literally the most day. basic In and Out, basic fast food place in the entire galaxy, and the line is around the parking lot every at every single one day at. All time every hour. of the day. Yes. That's 100 percent fact. And I said that Toro Seal, we went there a few weeks ago. I said, This is amazing that this drive through is still like this. And this has been here. Is in the pudding. And the prices are good. Phenomenal. Prices are great oh, yeah. too. There you go. There's another reason. Prices are good. Yeah. But I'm not I would never say it's the best burger. I would never I would prefer It's the best burger. It it's like I said, the guilty is free burger. Sometimes I get one and I'm like, dude, I can eat six of these and I won't feel anything. It's uh, the best burger in the entire galaxy by nah, far. No, it's not. Of the inner of, of fast food places. There's obviously a lot of burger places Telling where you, you can go. Culver's burger. burger is better than In-N-Out Burgers. It's just, it you shouldn't be. Culver's. What? When I said it, 10. No, it's 10. I didn't. I said it's the best burger of the time, but you will when, die. Watch your reaction when you watch this back. When I said number 10, Culver's, and you were like, Phew. Yeah, because I thought about uh, EKG. That's what I thought about. <laughs> yes. Um, all right, I got nothing else. And that's late. The other podcast yeah. is out there. All right, appreciate everything. Appreciate everybody listening, liking, watching, subscribe. Good episode, guys. Podcast mode is almost over. Anything else, guys? <laughs> Anything else? No. Go Dodgers. Okay. Go Dodgers. Baseball season officially started a week ago, so I'm excited. Uh, 
I don't blah baseball. Sorry. I'm excited. All right. All right. You gonna send us off or what? That's the secret. Pow, 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 pow. Pow, 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 pow. All right.